Hello, 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 Crafty Angels. Vanessa here from Angel Rose Designs here on YouTube. I have the lovely ladies with me. We have May, we have KK, and we have Miss Penny. Hello. Now, be careful, Miss Penny. I give y'all a fair warning. Y'all need some depend diapers now. Okay? Fair warning. Why, why is it always me? Am I the only type of in the group? You're the only one that has... Has the uh, great sense of humor. <laughs> you make me so we like all gonna be working on different projects. So I don't know what the ladies um, are working on right now. I'm working on. I don't know. Busting this here. I just saw some dots. Hello, hello, everyone. If you're just coming in, don't forget to hit the thumbs up. And guys, you're not leaving comments. I, I mean, I'm myself. I haven't left any comments, but um, uh -huh. I, I need to go in there and leave a comment, too. I did for the last other videos, but I forgot yesterday. But I took off like a bat out of hell. Anyway, I finished, or not finished, got my book. Hello, Miss Ashley. Hey, Ashley, how are you? Hi, Ashley. Hi. 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 My signature's in. Can I all the pages are the same size because I made some smaller than the other. Please do share this out and come back later and leave a comment. Yes. Yes. I've had you on my mind, Ashley, thinking about your family. Oh. What you guys do today? Um, woke up. I'm she said, I am good trying to get Dear Julie Julie's challenge done. I need to look at, I, I just got accepted to the group yesterday, last evening, I think it was. I need to go in there and see what this challenge is all about. That everyone's talking about. Yeah. It's all the rage, y'all. I might have to take part in it, too. I know. I don't know what it is. I'm curious. Well, is it in the group so we can go in and read real quick? Yeah, it's in the group. It's in the features, features. or somewhere in the files, I think. I finally used my, my coupon for, um, I went into Joanne's, a coupon came in. Um, oh, oh, great. I, well, they said I would have to call in to use um, the two coupons. So I said, you know what, I'm not taking this, I'm, I'm, I'm done. So I went in, that's why it took me so long. I went in, got some fabric to make my witch, my primitive witch. Okay. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna be doing. Well, not today, but. Okay. Let's Are see, dear today? Julie, Julie. Featured. I got accepted. So we know so what's coming what soon. Is. A witch coming soon. Oh, I love who did this journal. Kathleen Mower Mo did a beautiful journal in that group. That is absolutely stunning. Mm -hmm. right, if you don't way? mind, maybe we can share it if you want to do that. Share your screen, yeah, man. It's your, it's your channel. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Present. Friday freebie. Rain freebie. So this is Kathleen. I don't know who she is, but she, oh, September. I just finished Julie's September challenge, and it was such a fun one. Here's some pics of my journal and a link to my flip through. So she's got a YouTube. Look how beautiful. Look at the details of the splatters that is absolutely amazingly stunning i love, love the colors and oh mm -hmm. look at this it looks like she's been boss and then she kind of white through <gasps> and scratchy scratchy scratch oh that is absolutely stunning i'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to do something like that because i like it like that's my style oh look at that that is stunning Look at all the little torn up pieces of fabric. Oh, I'm gonna have to go to a YouTube channel. 
Gorgeous, gorgeous, ooh, gorgeous. Great job on this. This is, see, that's, I love this. This is absolutely, I, I love the splatter. Clean. I, it's clean. Yes, it's very clean. It's very, oh, so pretty. Great job. I love this. Absolutely love it. Okay, it has some so very, great. very talented people in that group, I tell you. All right, so where do we find the Hi, challenges, Paula. though? I, know, hey, I looked Paula. at teachers. I didn't see it. Oh, May, I don't know if you read my message uh -huh. in the private chat. Uh, I have to leave around 3.30 to go pick up my granddaughter at school. Yes, I think I saw and that. I said I would, I would. So it means we get 30 minutes okay. of shenanigans. Yep. We get to we get to act. Up. Oh, no, I'll be watching y'all from the car. Trust me. No, Mom's not. away. It's time to play. <laughs> yeah. Well, the cat's away. The mice comes out to play. All right. Hello, Miss right. Margaret. So we're... Maybe in Hi, the best... Margaret. Hi, Margaret. Upcoming mini challenge. Here we go. Tuesday, July 4th. Oh, okay. That's well, where is the, is, is this the one you guys are working on? Because this is almost, we only have like two more days before the month is over. Well, you're too late, Jen. Unless you're no not crafter. This has past events. Okay, so, hello. I wonder, is it uh, featured? Oh. It would be probably on the current. Files, maybe. I want more. I want it looks candy. like there's green. All right. No. Can someone help us here? We're new to this group discussion. Where should they go? Where should they go? Um, Ashley, where is the um, challenge? Is at? I think it's on the challenge, isn't it? Is there a tab that says challenge? There's no tab here that says challenge. Where's her store? Where do we see her store? It's on Etsy, dear Julie Julie. But here on the group, is there a link here? I don't know. Probably in the about. Where's the about? Well, I just looked on that. Oh. Uh, Looks like Facebook's got everything turned around. They do. <laughs> Challenge. I don't see. Oh, look on the it's right, there was a, there was oh, a, I found it. I found it, May. Hold on. I'll send you the link. Direct it to you. I found it. It says uh, September. Well, you should calendar. be able to share your screen. And I'm going to send it to you privately. May. There. What's that right there? It says I'll challenge it details. It. I'm sending it to Where? the group, too. In that yellow. On that yellow. On that yellow screen it was showing. Can you guys see my screen? Oh, there it is. Come back and say hello. September's challenge. Our 60th junk journal challenge. Wow, five-year challenge here. Thank you for everyone that has ever joined us, attempted to finish, fin finish, finished, or cheered everyone else to finish line. Come back and say hi. Come back and give it a try. Join us for the milestone challenge. There are prizes for all who who finish finish on time and post what they made. Okay, so it's on YouTube. We all have to watch your YouTube. But now we have the link, and we'll go watch it, and we'll join in. Uh -huh. Yeah, but it's it's done over on at the end of the month, isn't it? It's September yeah. Stash Buster Junk Journal Challenge details. Join for the 60th, dear Julie. Let's go. What the heck? Can y'all see still, still see a little bit of my screen? Mm -hmm. I'll yep. mute myself. Uh, we see we see craft communities. All I see. 
You might have to change your share screen. Okay. Oh, stop sharing. Oops. It's not what I wanted. Where am I? Okay. I gotta find myself. You're back to your desk. You lost? <laughs> Go left. All right, I gotta skip that. All right, I, I probably have to mute. Let's mute. I'm here with the 60th. That is six zero junk journal challenge here on the Dear Julie Julie channel. It's pretty exciting. As you guys, many of you know, um, Bonnie is the only person to have finished all 59 that we have had so far. And we are going to be giving you the details right now for the 60th junk journal challenge here on the Dear Julie Julie channel. channel. I did make a freebie Friday. This is available at buymeacoffee.com slash Dear Julie Julie, as well as patreon.com slash Dear Julie Julie. It is a free digital. When you go to those places, you'll find others as well. And um, all of the, di the free digitals are available in the crafty community, the Dear Julie Julie crafty community in the file section. Okay. So happy Friday. Let's check out the details. This month, it is our September Stash Buster Junk Journal Challenge 2023. Um, and here are the details. So this month, we will be making a journal um, or using a started journal and making and filling it with the required embellishments and pages. We already have one finished journal this month. Yes, you can make more. Um, I highly recommend it. Get some things out of out of the out of the stash and um, into a journal. Craft or ordinary ordinary items we can find around the house. Um, I didn't want to make this a no buy challenge, but. Um, if you don't need to buy anything, then go right ahead and make it just from your stash and things from around your house. Uh, the deadline for this challenge will be 9-30-23. Remember, there's only 30 days in September. Finish on time and post, and you're invited to a party. And you also receive a full digital kit. And I'm going to show you at the end of the video the digital it's a 65 page digital that those that finished their july challenge they received the, the digital form of this digital as their gift and then we made a project and this is what we've got so far at the vip and so um and so it's a lot of fun Okay, um, and then also you'll be the design team member for that uh, digital, okay? And here's what you need to do, okay? Again, you're gonna make, a, make or finish a new journal or finish an old one filled with all of the requirements. The journal has to have 60 or more pages front and back. Oh, so 60. when we're going Ooh. through and we're counting, we're counting yeah. one, two, three, four, five, six, and so on. Okay, so that's what we mean by front and back. Here it is. <clears throat> Here's what you need to do. That's 15 sheets, right? Um, again, the journal can be any type, any size. Okay, you must Only use 10 full your Julie Julie digitals. These can you be page like or ephemera through. digital page. With 12 Post pages. pick of the digitals you are choosing and your theme in the Four. special group. Okay, there is a post for that. Remember, there are free digitals in the files section Three at buymeacoffee.com slash Dear Julie oh. Julie or the patreon.com slash Dear Julie Julie in the public section. You will also make mini challenge 
in the challenge 9.1 and video instructions for that will be monday september 10th 2023 as m this coming monday is a holiday here in the united states you will have 21 types of embellishments or pages made when you are finished that's types of things you're going to be making more than that doing the number of each embellishment that is required you can finish this one in a day or in the month of september your finished journal is yours to keep, with share or sell okay so the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to use the stash buster list now I've taken, of course, this, the word stash buster, and I've broken it up into things. And you need to use at least one of the stash buster items in every single thing that every single requirement for this, um, for this month's challenge, for this month's journal. And you need to use um, each of the letters of scrap, scrap buster at least once okay so this is our scrap buster list so although you, you can use everything in your stash everything in your house um these are the things that are required for you to use so you might want to gather these together so the first thing is your scraps a scrap box second is trash so uh recycling things uh you know all those junk mail and stuff like that um accessories beads pins that's supposed to be p-i-n-s and charms okay um that could be broken jewelry um stencils hoarded so things that you're gonna find something that you've been hoarding and you know you've had it for a long time you just keep keeping it not using it you're gonna use something at least one thing in your journal books and pages is the b u is unused digitals unused digitals oh boy. So, I know a lot of that. um you know i just well i just did the the vip and i have this pile of the digitals that i didn't use okay from a project so the unused digitals is unused digitals from a project and or they might be the you know when you're running out of ink and you get purple <laughs> it might be those it might be time for a purple journal this month which is what i was planning um stamps and that can be uh you know wooden around rubber stamps it could be the uh what are they called well, anyway, the clear stamps, it could be a stamp, stamps that you make, um, but stamps. The next one is textures, sprays, and inks. Um, the next one is envelopes. And the last one, the R is remnants. That's fabric, ribbon, trims, um, that type of thing. Now, when you are um, counting each of the each of the things um you know you might use no, your I'm, stamps we're and your inks we're live. And, we're live watching um, on someone else's as long as that's not the only place that you use yeah, a stamp and word. ink you, you <laughs> you're to use one um but you can use two it's that's okay just make sure you use each of each of these categories at least once somewhere in your journal We'll be using at least one of these items from our scratch buster list to make our embellishments and pages on the following list. Okay, so the next batch says make and add all of these required 12 embellishments and pages to your base journal using items from your stash. stash. All must be enhanced or embellished with three things. That's a standard Dear Julie Julie thing when you're making it. An embellishment it is to be embellished or enhanced with three things now your enhancements are like your ink your spray your staples your sewing and then your embellishments of course would be um, adding flowers adding other digitals adding your tape adding 
your words, um, possibly adding lace, all of those things um, would be embellishing stamps. Um, yeah, so, okay. So these are the 12 things that you're putting into your base journal, okay? Your cover is to be embellished, and that is one of your things. So um, making your cover, uh, you're going to use the items from the 12, okay? No, the second one is a fabric pocket. The third one, a flip-flop page with a flap. Um, oh, double tech. It, that's supposed to be double tech. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> My computer even questioned it. Okay, so double tech. Layered belly band with mystery. So remember, a layered just, belly band is one that has layers. So you've got your, your, your oh. belly band base, and then you've layered it up. And then it's going to have a mystery. It might have a pocket. It might have a flip. It might do something. It might open this way and this way. Um, so it is a belly band with a mystery. That means it's it does something besides just lay there as a layered belly band it's fabric like flip with stack a note that's not stack or no huh? i think it's too late What's to that? do this one i think it's too late to do this one yeah actually yeah there's a lot there's a lot in October first okay yeah it's too late for this one because there's a lot entailed and we're not going to be able right. to do that in what two days Right. So great. It's great. But I, I love her concept of how she tried to get you to do things that you, you already have in your stash and using and thinking outside the box. So I do like that concept. So I can't wait to see what the October one has. So I'm looking forward to that. I can't either. All right. Can Hello, you? Angela. Hello, Angela. Hi, Angela. Ashley said, I'm a Patreon, so I get a sneak peek, and she said it will be good. Okay. Mm. Okay, well, I'll have to look at it. Ashley, where can we find the documents I will have at? to definitely look at that because... I she does a video every day showing it. Yeah, that document so that you're not having a... Oh, cool. Well, then I'll have to look at that. I'm not I much of a junk journal person. Like, I don't sit here and... You know, she got I, you through it. When I hear like still, or, or, or my stress level, level goes... <laughs> yeah, you know, she got you through it, it sounds like. It, 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 but, it'll, you know, it'd be good if someone... What's that? She guides you through, is that what you said? Yes. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, is, but the thing I'm not is, my to do that, she's live at the same time as we do. Oh. So we would have to watch the replay to what get she the live? idea. She has a live show during our live show. When was uh -huh. she live? She goes. She's oh, live right now. Do do? What, what, what? Oh, well. Is she really? Yep. Oh, darn it. I have to watch it on replay. Oh, wait. She went out, I think. Hang on. Let me double check that. I actually What's said you can watch it on studio? replay. No, she's gone. She's off. She's off now. But she's usually live when we start. She goes live at 1.30. Well, it's 2.30. Mm -hmm. I'd say she's already gone, come and gone. Let's see. Good to see you, you all ladies. Yes. Hope you're having a good day. So we're going to start in October on Sunday. She has a new one coming out. So we'll just pay attention. 
Mm-hmm. If you're not if close you're not, attention, if you're not so tired shopping at the sale, then you can go over and check her out and start your October challenge. Mm-hmm. Uh, she yeah. usually lasts about 30 minutes or less, unless it's on Friday, fun day. Okay. Well, she's okay. already gone out. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll have to keep an eye on that so that we can see. Um, I can make this a little small, so let's see. We'll have to go watch that a little. For sure. It sounds pretty <laughs> interesting. It sounds it sounds it sounds very interesting, actually. I was gonna say she has you intrigued, don't she? Yeah. Yeah, because I'm not much of a drunk. She has know. me intrigued, and I've been in her group for a while. Right. The only thing is, I can't find a list before she puts the I'm list. Not, I'm not been a very young journal, you know, kind of a not person. Under, does she not have a document file? Not that I've seen. That's why I asked Ashley where we can find it. We'll look in files and see if you see a document file. Hey, May, mm-hmm. check Facebook. Hi, Patricia. So glad to have you. On this cloudy cloudy day. KK's dog knocked over her printer and messed it up. Oh, ouch. And Miss Joyce just lost her little puppy, so she's not with Aww. us today. We miss her. Oh, wow. Uh-huh. We miss you ladies when you're not here. Yeah. We sure do. Okay. Oh, no, I'm still crying for my little Jack. Oh, bless your heart. All right, I actually said the list is under documents on the challenge group page. At the end okay. of the challenge reveal video on October the 1st, you can click on the link under the description box under the video and click on the document. Um, It will be in the file section of that group. Man, you're going to laugh at this. What's that? Hang on, it's coming. Read that. (laughs) Are you going to be decoupaging Miss uh, Vanessa? Yes, I am. Is today Friday? That's the title. (laughs) She makes a new group for each channel. Today is Thursday. (laughs) That's what I thought. All righty then. All righty then. Uh, (laughs) Funky Friday. Ashley, you weren't here yesterday. So uh, if you plan on having anything in the sale on the first you need to send a list to May with the items that you're going to sell and how many items of one you know 
Vanessa, you explain it. I'll let me explain it. Um, honestly, to be honest, uh, did do you want to? Did you want to explain it, KK? No, it's, I wanted to say that um, Ashley was trying to explain to us how to find the files, and what she's saying is is that Miss Julie creates a new group for every new challenge. So I just put the new group for the challenge in the chat. That's you have to join the group. So Miss Julie has Dear Julie Julie. Then she has September Stash Busters Challenge 2023 group. Oh. oh, she's got. She creates a group all the time. She makes a challenge. Oh. Yes, yeah. that's what Ashley said. So I just put the new that oh. comments. Got it. Got it. Patricia said her printer's messed up. Ah, hi, Miss Patricia. I didn't see you there. Oh. Yeah, I told you she is still crying. You didn't she's hear so, me. She's crying? Over her jack. Aww. I know. I know. That's hard. I guess we didn't see her Etsy store. Julie, Julie, I needed to click on the video to see if there's an Etsy store. Oh, let me get that for you. Honestly, this is what I think. I find it to be very, um, there's a lot of pressure when you're trying to set up for your sale. And on top of that, make a price list um, to give it to whoever the moderator is. I think if and which is how we always did it. It's, if you talk slow enough, we should be able to pick up, um, you know, when you're s s listing what you're sell selling. I just find it too stressful to sit here and make a list. I know, but Vanessa don't have anything to type when she types gold if we don't know what we're, you know, bidding on or wanting to say it well, with the person. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, and I understand. Yeah, but this is our first time doing this, so we didn't know, or it's my first yeah. time. I think aside from having to prepare for a sale, to sit here and make a list of everything you have. I mean, if you want to, that's great. If you don't have the time and you just want to, I mean, not, yeah, you can't list everything, but you list yeah. at least the the ten, maybe ten items. Um, so you're not feeling overwhelmed, I guess. Like I would feel overwhelmed. I get I get stressed out really easily. Yeah, you just grab and sell. I just what, grab what and sell. See. Yeah, what you see. Yeah, I because otherwise I stress out. And whenever I stress, I don't want to stress out for a sale. It's not my point of doing this. It's not to stress right. out. Right. So. But I'm going to have in mind on, you know, what I'm going to sell. So I will be able to make a list. You know what I mean? Because I know. Yeah, if I'm you don't have that much. I mean, if you have only two items, that's easy. You know? But if you've got a lot of items to sit here and, and type it all in and get it ready for the sale. I mean. It's Hi, short Julie. Hi, Miss Julie. Um. Ashley said, I will probably wait till the 15th sale so I am not rushed. Yes, that's You send it. We will give you an yes, email. Yes, that's true. I don't want to rush anyone because I know I stressed out if I'm rushed. And not, it doesn't, the point is not to feel stressed out. But what is your email, May? Um, hold on a second. We still have to come up with the time for that. Yeah, we don't even have a time yet. Um, why do I have to? I can't. This is not me. Hi, Miss Julie. May, did you like his Facebook page?
the leprechaun. Oh, yeah. dear lord. Oh, I'm chilling, y'all. I'm chilling. So, because this is this is like an improvised thing, we didn't really have a whole lot of planning for this because it just happened. Um, it's going to be on the first, and we're going to say probably one o'clock, which is what we normally come in, which is one cent one central to eastern on Sunday, and it will go into probably I would say. I don't know, seven. I think that's fair enough. Seven central. What do you guys think? So, I didn't, I didn't, yeah. I didn't. It'd be two yeah, to eight for us. Yeah, two to eight. Um, yeah, and so the whole thing is I don't want anyone, I don't want anyone at all stressed over this. It's well, not, I might have to go to the bathroom during them hours. <laughs> well, you can go to the bathroom. Can <laughs> you go? <laughs> You go. <laughs> We're not going to hold you back from using the bathroom. It, you, it, might take me an hour. it might take me an hour. <laughs> I'm just well, kidding. If it I'm takes you an hour, then the hogs eat me up. If it takes you an hour, it takes you an hour. <laughs> but for the next one, it's always going to be, I would say, um, one o'clock is a good time to do it. Right. I mean, because right. it gives you enough time to get your house ready, get things organized. I'm that kind of person. I have to have things done in my house before I can sit down and do anything else. And I don't know if right. anyone else is like that, but that's me. You got family first, yeah. Right. And so get your family done first, and then we'll jump on here. I'm like one. it. Um, and I don't like to be rushed. That's why I said getting a list. If you can't get that list ready, um, if it's something that I, I we can clearly, and that's how we did it before, if I can see what's on the screen, we can say it's a stamp. Well, that's a perfect size. Right. Um, a stamp, $5. So we'll right. say, okay, stamping up stamp, um, butterflies, or whatever we can see. You can tell yeah, us can on the screen. Like we can type it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, if Actually, you go, say, for instance, it's a paper pad. That'll be central time. That was central. Central time, 2 p.m. Eastern. It's the same time we go live during the week. So it's 2 Eastern, 1 Central, 12 Mountain, 11 Pacific Standard Time. So, for example, if this you're selling this 8x8 Halloween paper pad, we'll put Recollection, ha Happy Halloween, 8x8 paper pad, say $5.00. And we'll type that and then type go. Um, you know, some people don't want to. I'm, I'm not a list kind of a person like that. So I'm not. Don't ever get a list from me. You're never going to get a list from me. You're <laughs> just. just a, you're just. A, what is it? Some people, people are, you're a rogue. Just organize you're a rogue. And go. Yeah, she's a rogue. I'm not. Yeah. I, and I might change my mind as to what, because it depends on what people are wanting to see that you don't know what people are wanting to say, see, you know, you just don't know what the, the vibe is when you go live. Someone, yeah. some people might want to see certain things. Right. So as long as you're telling us what to type, we should be fine. You know, say you got yes, a stamp set, you tell us. It's the stamp set, and I mean that way. It eat, as you, as long as but, you have but, an but, inventory, but, but, I don't. But but, but 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 here was the purpose of the list, May, so that we will know how many people who's wanting to sell and how many items they want to sell, so that we can budget our time. Well, that yes, you can tell me, but you can tell me I'm selling. 20 items, we can calculate that. If you can right. give me a round park, a, a round around a ballpark of what you're going to be selling, how many items you're going to be selling. I don't need to know because okay. I think that's micromanaging to the max and I'm not about micromanaging. Okay. So if you can tell me I'm going to be selling 20 items, they're all priced, ready to go. When you get ready to go, just keep in mind that we're typing what you're telling us to type in the chat. 
Okay. You need to keep accountable for what you're selling. I don't need to know what you're selling and how much you're selling them for, because that would be me micromanaging. And, and we need to know if you want to sell so that we know who's going to sell so we can manage the time. Yes. All we're wanting to do is manage the time. So you, you figure out you're selling, you're going to get a certain amount of time. Everyone's going to have a certain, if whether or not, and I actually, everyone's going to get a certain, like I would say everyone's going to get an hour, right? Now, if within that hour you sell out, great. Then we'll move on to the next person. You know, right. if, if, if everyone's allotted an hour to sell and we'll rotate. So first hour, um, say KK, second hour, say me, third hour, say Vanessa, uh, fourth hour, say Ashley. And then if you're finished early, we can bring in someone else or go back to the first person that started and rotate each other back and forth that way. Mm -hmm. Okay, dokie. Okay, dokie. You know, but to me to say, I need to listen this and this and this and that, I don't need that I, because that's me having to have paper and having, no, I don't want all that. I don't want to, I don't want to know the people's business. I got enough to do on my own. So. That's, does that mean, is that fair enough? I, I know it's there's someone enough. else out there. There's someone else out there that needs to know what you're selling. I'm not, I just find that to be too much. You know, they want to know what you're selling, how much you're selling it for. And their purpose is that they want a commission off of that. And I don't need commission. Off oh, of no, 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 no. We don't want that. We were just wanting to know how yeah. many items you have and. So we'll know yeah. about. Okay. Honestly, if you're allotted an hour, hour within that you're hour, and make if you're it not fast, finished selling, you got to stop. Yeah. Right. If within that hour you sell, if you if you didn't get through all your stuff, then you'll have to wait for the next round of, you know, if 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 we have four people and within those four people, we we'll just keep rotating hour every hour, someone else uh, every hour, someone else. It. Okay. And that way everyone gets a chance, a fair enough amount of time to sell. I think within an hour, if you're fast enough and you're, you're, you yourself on your end, you're organized, then you should be able to boom, 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 get it done. Mm -hmm. Now you say here and you describe, this is the other thing that I find annoying. Oh, I, I hate when I dig go. I hate when they have to dig and dig and dig. I, you know, I don't like it. Well, I don't like it when I go to a sale and they're just telling you every detail oh, about the Lord, item oh, Lord, and, oh, and yeah, they'll like go on either. for 10 minutes I describing like the item. Just say what it is and get it done. Get it pop. Boom. Bap, that, right. right. But if you're sitting here and describing every and going through every page of your book, like seriously. If I like, see oh, here I and go a, through I have all... a mold in there. Let me go hunt it. Oh, I know I have a mold in there. I don't like it. Yeah, you you go in here and you go right there and you uh, and go page and you describe oh, and no, no, you no, no, say no, 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 no. that kills your time. It kills the mood. And someone in the chat that was interested is now no longer interested and they're entertained by some if me attend and you're you're talking to someone with attention to details or not not attention i have add so you've lost my attention i, I am see, not that's when you in tell that. them that they're going to get a surprise you give right. them a, a, a overall uh, you know description of it but yes they'll get they'll be surprised when they open it up you can flip through it but you don't need to go through every single page you give them the measurements of it is a one and a half by four and a quarter album it has three signatures um and flip through it you know briefly flip through the main pages you know give them, an, give a, them a quick quick yeah, thing we know that's you know, a halloween you know it's a halloween theme there's there's olive green there's orange it's got uh distress coffee dyed paper and that's an boom ad. that's yeah. it while the person so you sit here and you say i have this halloween album it is one and a half uh, inch spine by four and a quarter, um, three signatures. And I want, say, $30. The person, the moderator, is going to type in Halloween uh, junk journal book, handmade. $30. Uh, one and a half by four and a quarter, $30 go. While everyone is bidding on it, um, 
or if it's a bid, if it's a bid while everyone's bidding on it, um, you can flip through the pages. But if if you go go and the first person says, okay, all right, done deal, wrap it up, next item. That's how you sell fast. Exactly. I can tell you, I, I'm serious. I Julie. when Carl and I when Carl and I did this. When Carl and I did this, we went through more stuff and we had more in sales because we weren't sitting there describing every inch of the item. I may. How about doing a kit, but they go through the entire kit over for over 30 minutes. <laughs> no. Did I do that? Did Maybe I do that? Step in and she's going to say, hey, hey, hey. Look yeah, on, because then on. you took half... <laughs> Then, then that means you took half of your time going over one item and then what are you going to do for the rest? You know what I mean? So we actually would sell a lot more because we would go bam, bam, boom, boom, next I like item. A, I like a fast-paced sale. Yes. We don't want you to sit here and describe this This, this item has um, – and then go through every single thing okay like no we don't want that because then you're gonna you're gonna take up a lot of time and you've lost the the, the flies are gonna be like flying away you know right. you've lost show the you item and get on with it yeah get on move next that's how you're gonna sell more and we actually we said just say like the theme and maybe how many pieces are in the kit right that's, that's exactly great. exactly boom boom get to the next that way you'll sell more than you sit here and going through every you're not going to sell a lot if you sit yeah. here the and more items you, you have well ashley had a question what if you have a 10 and they're similar all you have to do is say i have this many 10s and not all of them are the same Right. So they'll be surprised. Right. Yeah. The more items and you can you do show, A, B, the and more C. items you're gonna sell. Right. And if this like like we would do, we had this this is A, this is B, but they're all the kits. They have something maybe a little bit different. So this is A, this is B, this is C. We're gonna say this one here, this kit here is the lavender colors, this one here is the pink color, this one here is the ivory colors. Flip through it real quick. Just real quick flip. It's their surprise, you know, and then go through it, flip it real quick, boom, bam, get it out. Yeah. Because most times, if, most of the times they're going to know if they're going to want it or not, you know? Right, right. And I'm not just trying to be, and I don't want, and also I don't want to be mean to anyone or anything like that because I've heard that going on. I'm not, I don't want to be mean to anyone. I want to, I want you guys to sell your stuff and I want to be, have fun. I have a lot of people. We're yes, gonna have, have fun. fun. And I and I have a lot of patience for people. The goal is to get you to sell your stuff, sell it, make money. I want you to guys make money. And I guarantee linger. you, don't linger on one we, certain item. Right. We could easily generate in a sale. We did we did about two sales, three sales a month, but we easily generated anywhere from five thousand to ten thousand. Why? Because we were quick. Boom, 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 fast. That's it. That's all I took. So, yeah. We weren't here describing every every detail of an item. I don't want to hear pulling that. Pulling out every tag, pulling out every tuck spot and all that. I'll guarantee you, if there's someone out there that wants it, they're going to say they want it. Right, right. If mm -hmm. within a minute or two, time yourself. You can put a timer on your desk. If you show this item... And within two minutes, there's no interest. Grab your next item and move on. Ooh, and or you, you tell them. And you can tell them, okay, if there's anyone that wants this after the live, if it does, if it doesn't sell, just contact me. Send me a message. Um, I'll sell it to you. Um, that way, you're you're not gonna lose a potential sale of someone that might come to the the watch the replay you know be, uh -huh. just because it didn't sell during the live that doesn't mean that someone after the live is not going to want it because that's yeah. happened to me a lot of time um someone wasn't there or they didn't catch it because they were in the bathroom or you know the mailman came to the door or something happened someone missed it but they'll contact you it happened to me many times so give or yourself you a time be, to uh you can be like KK 
and if you want to go through your item page by page, put it on your own channel and then tell them that it will be up for sale. Right. Right. So it, I, I you just want to say that, you know, the idea is that we want you guys to relax, make money, have fun. Ashley said, this will really help me, I think, because I was going to do a craft show, but I had family issues that caused me to have to cancel the show. And we're so oh. thankful to have you. Yes. 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 And it, it, you know what? You're going to probably reach people that maybe at the show you couldn't. And, you know, honestly, by the time you set up, I've thought about going to shows, but by the time you set up at a show, you pay um, you it's a lot. Booth fee. Yeah, the booth seat fees. Um, so, yeah. Yeah. Julie says, oh, my gosh, I know that person. What? What person? The one that goes through up. everything, shows everything, oh. takes all the time showing. <laughs> so, uh, Julie, right now it's just me, KK, Ashley's going to do it on the 15th. So I'll get a calendar and put Ashley down for the 15th. I'll so we have on the 15th. Penny, you're going to go on the 15th or not, not going to do this weekend? No, I won't have my stuff this weekend. Okay. So we have me, KK, Vanessa, right, Vanessa? I thought she was going to do 15th too. I'm going to wait okay. till the 15th so I can get enough stuff done. All right. Okay. So we have me, KK, and Julie. If you want to jump in, um, that'll be good. And then that way we'll we'll probably and if we need to extend it to, we're gonna do it. No, Sunday no. Monday. You're oh, and Nona. Nona. Yes, Nona. Nona. So that's four of us then. If you're interested, yes. Craft craft shows are very. And I had I had my witch. I don't know if you guys saw my witch. I had to redo it. I took it to a, a shop and they stole it. Which That's I'm very terrible. upset about. That's it. awful. I very don't even Facebook. understand. I don't understand how you can steal a freaking four pieces, and and you didn't see it. Okay, no, I wasn't in the store at all. Wow, that's horrible. Yeah, I wasn't in the store when my my little y'all saw my video from you y'all. Think the store you? should have been responsible. I think the store owner stole it because that was it was the witch's hat that I did live with oh, the uh, the witch's shoes and the witch and the wings. The whole Julie set was says gone. I only have crafting supplies. I don't have projects. That's fine. That's what I'll. That's be fine. Selling. I'm going to be selling craft supplies too because I have the stamps and the papers that I bought from um uh that place in um that lady in Houston. And then tomorrow I'm going to Austin to see if there's anything at the creative reuse shop that I can buy to resell. So. Oh, May, May, sell. May. Please. Mm -hmm. You haven't read us a, 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 a journal page uh, in a long time. Oh, that's right. So, yeah. So I'm going to probably be going tomorrow to Austin to get some stuff from the creative reuse sale. Uh, and that's what I'm going to sell. So if you want to sell your laces, that's okay. Don't want us to try and price them as they would be shipped do you want us to try and price them as they would be shipped or do shipping at at what okay so here's what i suggest when you sell you're selling say for instance i'm going to sell this punch say five dollars it does not include shipping so what I do is I go to the post office, I get uh, mailers. You can go online and get the uh, bubble wrap flat rate envelope, the padded envelopes, which I need to order some um, today. Remind me that. Um, and you can get them mailed to your home. I get medium, large, and the small. I'm not going to have time to order the, get the, or the flats for now, but you can get the padded envelopes from Dollar Tree. Um, for a dollar twenty-five. Anyway, you, I put baskets. Um, I get the the here. Let me show you. I get the Dollar Tree baskets, and I put names on them. Here's a perfect example. I put uh, index card with names on them, and as the people are ordering, 
I put their name, their stuff in there, or I get the gallon size bag. I got a big old basket, didn't I? Yeah, I get gallon size <laughs> bags and I put with a sharpie. Um, I put their name on the bag and how we did it is I would put the person's stuff in there and um, if it's something like this, I put in a smaller bag and like a cellophane bag, put their name on it and on the cellophane bag, I put the price. You can cut out little pieces of paper um, with price tags and stick it in there. I found that that was time consuming for me they while I was doing off. the sale and they could fall out, exactly. So what I did is I take a cellophane bag one, it protects it. Um, it has double protection, so it's not damaged. So I put this in a cellophane bag in the outside. I put the person's name and the price. As I'm taking each item from the person's basket, I go on to um, PayPal. I start, okay, you got a handmade Halloween book, $5. I'm just saying $5 for now. It's not really $5. Um and then I'll go to the next item, a punch, $5, um, a lampshade, $5. I add it up. I put it in the bag, in the little bag like this, and then I stick it into their, their box. If it's a medium flat rate box, I calculate it, okay, if it all fit into a medium size box. In Pirate Ship, you will see, go to Pirate Ship, you will see the prices for the medium, large, and small. Take that price and put it in your PayPal. Calculate your shipping when you invoice and when you figured out their shipping. That's how I did it. And then once I I calculated while I was invoicing their shipping, I put it all in and submitted it to them for their invoicing. That's how I did. Does that answer your question? Julie it makes said, it easier. He's going to have bags of doilies and bags of flowers. Well, there we go. All right. So then, um, then, um, we'll, we'll have you come in, uh, Sunday and Monday. We'll be live Sunday, Monday. So the idea is, um, get a basket or a bag or whatever she you said have. That's great advice. Good. Uh, well, any other questions you have, you can always, um, ask me whatever else you have at home. Um, you know, like if, if you got, um, 10 items in that person's basket, when you go into invoice them, calculate it all up, try to fit in the, one of the shipping boxes. And what I do is for instance, um, I have shipping boxes pre-made like this, ready to go. And once I put all the stuff inside one of these ba uh, boxes and I can give you the link to the gallon size bags that I use so that I stick that gallon size ba bag inside and I put the person's name and then I put uh, their total amount that they owe me, including the shipping. So that way I know this is gonna go to Penny. Her total amount was this much, including shipping. I close it up. When the person pays, I print out their shipping label. Boom, it's ready to go. Okay. Uh, those boxes right there are free. Yes, and those are free. Yes. Those I always ship. You can get them from the I post normally, office. Right. I go to the post office and get the medium, small, and the large priority flat rate boxes. It's free. It's cheap. Okay. If I'm using a box because this person has ordered a lot more and I've had a lot of people because I used to do a lot of sales. I would go get a box and I would measure it, uh, weigh it, and I have a scale. And I would go to Pirate Ship, which is free, estimate the shipping. I get the person's. That's why they have to email you their mailing address. And that's important that you tell them that their mailing address has to be the exact same one you, you're going to, they have on their PayPal. If their mailing address is different, it is not my responsibility. Um, make sure that whatever mailing address they email you, it corresponds to the PayPal mailing address. Because sometimes you do use PayPal to ship out of directly. And sometimes I do and sometimes I don't. Um, it all depends on, um, well, I know PayPal now has a fee. I was going to ask you about that. 
Um, yeah, PayPal, like it did have a fee when um, I had stopped using PayPal directly because they did have a fee for shipping and pirate ship to me is free. Okay, but um, I have a question about PayPal. Mm -hmm. Like I don't have a business and I don't want to pay all of the PayPal fees and I would rather them pay me friends and family. Am I allowed to do that since I don't have that many sales? Um, I would I would say so because you don't have a business. I can't right. get away with that because right. I've had a business. Right. My but I mean, I mean I, I'm not selling right. everything. Now, now what what happens with uh, friends and family is make sure that the addresses are whoever right. you are buying from as friends and family, you can trust. I can tell you guys we can trust Penny because I know Penny for many years now. So I know you can trust Penny. You can't do that with a lot of people because you never know if they're going to take your money because you have nothing to claim with oh, PayPal to do that. Oh, I um, wouldn't do that to no one. Yeah, no, and I know you. So I can I can sit here and stick my neck out for Penny because I've known her. Has a jumbo size five-gallon bag count to, I don't know, but I can tell you, um, Ashley, if you send me a message on Facebook, I'll give you the link that I get from um, from uh, Amazon where I get my cellophane stuff um, so you can buy them. It's not that expensive. I think I pay maybe $20 for 50 bags. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on it. It's been a while. You can um, buy gallon bags because I have some. The well, I, well, this one is 12. What is it? Because I used to use it for the store. Okay. So this one is... See how big these are it's like 13 by 18 or whatever that is oh and so i like for people who don't buy big bulky stuff i stick it on here it's protected oh, so right. like Those i are said bigger I take, gallon yeah right i take my cellophane bags and i have various bags that i always i take say for instance i'm going to ship this here i know this was say i don't know I'm, I'm making it up ten dollars not really but I stick it in here. I say this was going to Penny ten dollars. I put Penny's name on this bag. This with is the, the main bag. You got right with sharpie. a sharpie. Always sharpie. I seal this up because this particular item was ten dollars and it's going to Penny. This we, is we Penny's are bag. This is Penny's bag, and I'm going to stick it in here. When I go to calculate the uh, invoice or start to invoice this person. I grab that full bag and I'll sit in front of PayPal with my invoice and I start pulling. I have a basket next to me that's empty. I start pulling. I pull out this one. I invoice it, say it's a book, $10. So grab that, put it in the empty basket, grab the next item from the bag, a uh, punch, $5. I in entered it in, grab that punch, stick it in that basket. So I keep taking from this bag to the basket once i have it all added up i stick it back in here making sure everything's back in here and i keep double checking with my invoice as i stuff it back into this bag and then i pack it up nicely and then i take it and i stick it into my shipping box and i'll stick it all in there nice and neat and i put penny and whatever her total was based off the invoice that's how i do it Ashley said, may want to make a disclaimer, no returns, and all sales are final. That is part of our Yes, rules. that is always That's... important. That is always, always very important. There she is no, return, no return. We are not responsible for anything that the post office may damage, okay? Um, and if we can create a little group, um, I can go over how I did it. I'm going to tell you how I did it for many years. Um, I've been selling online, believe it or not, since November of 2011. Um, that's how long I've been selling online. So with that being said, um, yes, thank you, Miss Carrie. I can do a little uh, Facebook group and we can go live private on a little private video, Zoom call, whatever. I can show you step by step how I go on to pirate ship how I invoice on PayPal, and how I package. You can see how I package it. Here's another what, problem. What's that? Julie, don't take PayPal. 
I can't make PayPal and why can't you make PayPal invoices? That's as well as the long as your oldest son. Oh, wow. <laughs> she only does square, she says. She only does square? Yeah, and I don't do square, so. I never updated address with my with me and PayPal denied her claim. There was a woman. There was someone that I shipped an order to and she told me she moved across the state, but really she moved a couple blocks away and filed a claim with PayPal. It won't work. I downloaded the PayPal invoices six times. Okay, so you do a square should allow you to invoice. However, you I mean, however you use your invoice, I mean that's I mean it might be that you have to do another PayPal account. That's probably what you'll probably have to do is you create another PayPal account. And you can invoice, you can create invoices straight from um, your Microsoft Excel uh, spreadsheet. I don't know. Um, but if you guys, if you, I can, I can go over a lot of this stuff on, and I'm not saying I'm an expert. I'm just saying that I have been selling for many years, many, many, many years. I think PayPal is the best company to go through when you want to take money or receive money. I, I agree because you are protected as a seller and of a buyer. As a seller and as a buyer, you are very well protected. And I'm saying is I've been selling for many, many years and I've never had a problem like that. I mean, right, I haven't either. And I, I mean, of course, I've always shipped and I've shipped worldwide. I've always, I've always received everything I've ever paid for. Yeah, I have shipped worldwide. I have Vanessa knows me from how many years, Vanessa, when I had my one store. I mean. Vanessa's picking up her granddaughter. I can definitely, Ashley, I can definitely help you. I've been doing this for many, many years, and I can definitely help you get through um, how, where to get your supplies. I have a label printer, the thermal printer labels, just to save you on shipping and save you on time. I can go through all of that, and I can create a little video chat where I'm showing you how I set it up here. Before we do the 15th, now it's too late. But before we do the sale on the 15th, I'll show you how I set my baskets here with names and how we put it all out. And it's nice. And we can go through that like that. And Julie, um, I love Square. It's so easy when it's come. So do you, I'm, I'm assuming with Square, you can do invoicing um, through Square. So you, however you invoice, that's up to you. My store no, only says Never mind. Nobody won't understand. Right. I don't like giving my credit card or my bank card out. Yeah, I don't uh, either. I don't either. I won't. I won't give my. And that's why. That's why I said most people don't want to do the square because their information is not very well. It's not protected. It really right. isn't. Yeah. All right, guys. So we are. Um, this is uh, Sunday, January 7th. This is a couple we've been reading. This diary was from 1951. I was lucky enough to come across um, this lovely family. And so we are in Sunday, January 7th, 1951. Okay. Uh, Miss, Be Miss Bean called to see if I would go, if I was going to church. But for some reason, I decided later June cold. I didn't feel good, so I did not go. I in. Oh, sorry. I inhaled something powder. I inhaled some powder penis penicillin. Oh wow! I inhaled some powdered penicillin, and and this is the hard part, understanding someone else's penmanship and something to have stopped it. The weather warmed up 
in the afternoon, the sun shone. I took Irene Crawford and Claire Van Deer for a drive. The they enjoyed the sunshine and being together. Hmm. Huh. June came for me. We went to speech arts at Richmond. If people buy from me, I want to be billed through PayPal and want to be billed through PayPal. I will do that. But if you say nothing, then it will be through Square. You want, you want receive, you won't receive, sorry. You won't receive an invoice on PayPal. This, that is the only thing. Oh. As long as you give a person an itemized, that's important, an itemized invoice. I can't tell you how many times I've bought from people and they will sit there and they give you an invoice. KK, I like your sweater. What is that? I love little stripes on it. I like it looks kind of Halloween-ish. <laughs> yeah. I'm cutting it. Um, I cannot tell you how annoying it is when you get a, an invoice from somebody. And this happened to me years ago. Where I Just got an invoice for the, <laughs> for the total amount, and then when, well, not even years ago, um, up until uh, what was it, 2021, I also got one. Um, and when I got the stuff, I knew there was stuff missing, and that is a problem to me. That is an entire problem because then how how are you going to prove that there was something wrong? You know, right. so. That is a problem. Hi, Nona. Hey, Miss. No, why am I bringing this up? Was that all that was on that day? Huh? They enjoyed the weather, and that was all that was on that day. Oh yeah, that was all they they enjoyed that day. You might want to tell uh, Ashley what that is. What we've been doing. Oh, Ashley. So. I think this is I've I came across a a lot of vintage ephemeras from a family um and I have been going through all their stuff that I got now the couple died I think the wife was 92 when she died and the husband was 80 something when he died or was he 90 something like that I can't remember it's been uh, a while so, since you, we've been into the book, so I can't remember now. We, I know it's been a while. But, Margaret, and his yeah. name is Aubrey. Aubrey, yeah, Aubrey and Margaret. So we've been really invested on this family, and um, you've went two or three times and got more and more and more. Yes, I got like I don't know. Uh, 15, 16 bags of ephemeras from this family. Wedding and, pictures. Yeah, wedding pictures, all kinds of neat stuff. Yeah. From back in the, the it goes back to the 30s, the 40s, and the 50s. Mm -hmm. All the way up until up early 1900s. Yeah. Right, because they some of them just died. The daughter just died. The daughter died in December 22nd of 19, uh, December 20, December of 2022. She was 80 years old. Yeah. But it's very interesting. It is to me. Oh, Margaret. So, yeah, that is so neat. See? And this couple here, um, let me show you who they look, what they look like. So see, here's something I've gotten from them. I got baskets and baskets of stuff. So this is like his uh, graduation memory of the husband. And this goes back to the early 1900s. He graduated in 1930. And this is their wedding invitation stuff. So it's like really cool stuff of when they got married. May supposed to be making us a digital. Yes, we're supposed to be making digitals. I, I just gotta stop being lazy. It's about being lazy. Um, KK, Julie wants to know when you're gonna start selling your uh digitals. KK, 
I'm sorry. I'm here. Um, I don't know. I really don't know. I really don't know. I'm, I'm like, I'm just seeing on now. Like yeah, money. she don't have a desire right now. <laughs> right. There you go, Penny. She answered it for me. I'm trying to think of, what do you think about that cover? Hold on. It's looking good. Yeah, I love her. I love the stars. I, yeah, I love the stars. I like that. And you said, okay. I don't know if I want it like this. I don't like see, this. Let's see it with the yellow. Yeah. Just put it with the yellow instead of the gray or the black. Well, it's not the exact size. I'm messing, like I said, I was in Canvas making the cut file. But. I like it with that yellow and maybe put a tab oh, up in there in that little corner. Right here? Yeah. Miss Patricia's back. But I like, I also like that little witch cut out that you had. You know, the one. That... Oh, yeah. Um, I'm trying to relearn using Canva on my laptop because I'm so used to doing everything on my iPad. Right. That little die cut witch that you had. Yeah, I cut out with my um, brother. Oh, okay. Do you have any more work. of those? Um, I can cut out more. Oh. I can cut out that more. might be cute there. Yeah, that's a lot of stars. Oh, my stars. Right now, I only have experience with background pages. Welcome back, Patricia. Um... Well, like my toe tag of uh, digital. How much should I sell that page for? Just by itself. A dollar? I don't know. I do near. There's what, five on it? There's six on it. Six? Yeah, two, four, six. Actually, there's seven. I believe. I believe. And I believe I, I can... Fly. Like skin, don't it? I believe I can touch the sky. This is from Dollar Tree's uh, paper packs. You know, I have some of those, yeah. And Isn't it I pretty? Thought, I mean, yeah, it, looks I was, it looks leather. Yeah, I was thinking mm -hmm. like right here. WCF uh, says hi, hi. Mike's saying hi, May. Hey, Mike. How are, how are you? Do I know you, Mike? Not long enough. <laughs> Not long enough. They know you. I know. I oh, think you're funny. I've you're that name before. I know. I think it was from back when the guys from um right. the the lawn mowing the lawnmower guys, right? Right. I'd hope so. <laughs> Uh-oh, May, what have you been doing? Fresh <laughs> oh, my memory, Mike. I'm probably bad. I'm horrible. No, nope, it wasn't a lawnmower, guys. Oh, Lord. What have I? Who was it, then? Ashley's wanting to dine in Boston Papers to make a kit. Where are you from, Mike? Where are you from? Hey, Mike's my favorite name, ain't it? Mike's. <laughs> <Our lemonade. laughs> All right, Mike. And curi curiosity killed a cat. So tell us where you're from. Because I know lots of crafting ladies from Tanya McGuire and Lisa, Kathy V, and so on. V. Kathy B. Who's Kathy B? Kathy Van Zandt. Oh, man. Anyway, welcome, welcome. And sorry, I, I have such a you, crappy you've talked, memory. Yeah, you've talked to him probably on somebody's crafty show. Yes, I'm sure I have. And I apologize that I don't remember right now.
but we're glad you came. Yes, absolutely. We just how are you? We just have fun. How are you? Yeah, I hope all's well. Okay, I'm trying to figure out. I'm doing um. Do you craft, Mike? Figured if anything, this would make a shaker. Yeah, those stars. Yep. Yeah. And then these extra ones I can use as pockets. It's funny, uh, you were saying, because I remember I said I was going to use leather on my my little All right, spine. Ashley. Uh -huh. on my spine because i had gotten leather the other day from uh hobby lobby i'll keep that in there it may have been what her name that does the paranormal stuff now too and yes i, I do want to remember yes mandy and yes i do craft I Yes, Mandy. How is she? She just needed a little jog in the brain. I've been I've menopause has been kicking my butt and it's been <laughs> a spirit it's squad, yeah. That's it, Mandy. Yeah, Mandy. Well, yes, yes. Good old Mandy. How is she? I, we were just talking about her the other day because we could There's not figure song. out what happened to her. Isn't there a song called Mandy? Rod Stewart. Or... Oh, Mandy. She does paranormal stuff? Yeah, Ooh. she's got paranormal stuff. Ooh, I don't know. She scared me. She would, wouldn't she? No, she wouldn't. You'd be fine. Paranormal. Hey, she I does don't... paranormal investigations now, from what I Oh, heard. I'm afraid of my own shadow, so... Or my hair. Oh my gosh. Now that my hair's long made, if I turn if I'm laying here and my hair will fall and it'll touch my arm. <laughs> hey, did you get your grass cut yesterday? No, I didn't, but I did go out there and my lawnmower wouldn't start. So I had to tell Ronnie that he's gonna have to come in battery char charge up my battery or uh give me a boost. The guy that borrowed my lawnmower left the, uh, I don't know how, but he left, he left the ignition on and it ran down my battery. All right, she she's good. Her other channel really took off and that's more of her theme now. Yes, I figured, you know, I, I figured that that best kind of stuff is, it's big now, you know. I, and I was telling the ladies I went, and I need to get a hold of her because I went to a haunted place here in Seguin, Texas. It's it's made it to uh, Ghost Adventure, made it. Um, Ghost Adventures is um, been featured in it. It's been featured in Ghost Files. Uh, just did a big thing on it. We stayed there. Wasn't scary at all. Um, KK. Woohoo! Let's go Mountaineers. Yay! I like the Mountaineers, but I like the Volunteers better. <laughs> yeah. Don't hold it against me, but I don't watch football anymore. Especially college football. I like the Volunteers. 
I, I lost interest like years ago. I am from Tennessee. I want to say one and a half, so I need one and a half. Hey, Meg. Uh, we're both from a from a state with a T, uh -huh. and our colors are orange and white. But mine is a bright orange and white, and yours is a dull orange and white. You know, mm -hmm. the Texas Texas A and M or Texas whatever. Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I gotta wait for my mat to dry. I do have leather. He said hi to Carrie. He's having coffee. Oh, coffee. Remember that one guy? I forgot Buford. Oh, Buford. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> Wonder what happened to Buford. I know he had gotten, he was in a car accident or something. And Aww. Well, if you speak, Mike, if you speak to um, Mandy, tell her, send me a message. Because I wanted to tell her about this house here. Supposedly. There was supposed to, yeah, a little girl got killed in the town. Was made I agree. Right? Mm -hmm. And they're saying that her ghost went our way to another town and yeah they're saying her ghost is over here in in texas and her ghost left why is that wrong her ghost left uh, our town where she died to go to that town um and I cut this wrong. How did I manage to cut this wrong? Thank you. I think you uh, turned it the other way. Yeah. Mono. That looks all right. No, it's a little short. Short. And I need to make a B for it because I want to put a B thingy. Yeah. Like I did that one time where you I have did a it bigger like piece. I do. Um, when I did that other. Uh, this didn't one you make where... one of my bottles, Vanessa? It lights up. I think that one... roses on it. I thought I bought it from your auction. Probably so, because she likes roses. Who? Uh, Vanessa, she's gone right now to pick up her granddaughter, so that's why she's not answering. He wants to know if he bought one of her bottles. And I, she, he said it had roses on it and lights up. I said it probably was because she likes roses. Who, Vanessa? Yeah. She probably did, yeah. Two, two and a half. Let's do three. The one book that I did that was in that witch. I don't know if Miss Carol got that. Miss Carol's on it. That dress form that I did. The Carol that passed away? No, Carol Brickman. Oh. No, that was Carol Brickman is the one that passed away. Carol Bounds or got the dress form that has that witch book that I did. Oh. Got the bound, the leather bounding on it. What what was the guy's name that that came on with his wife and they lived up north in Ohio and they did the lawnmower and stuff? Oh yeah, I remember that crazy guy. Um, I remember he still does lawnmower too. Does he really? They're mm -hmm. crazy. Yeah, said his daughter had the migraines and his daughter. Wait. From Ohio? Yeah. He had a daughter and she had migraines. Hmm. Or her daughter. It could have been. I thought it was his daughter too. But I don't remember that one. I think. I can't remember his name. Steve. Let's see. I'm going to cut. 
who was the guy that thought he was Mr. Mis- Mr. America? I don't, <laughs> I don't remember that. <laughs> King you Norman. Much- King Morgan's in the house. I don't remember a lot of this stuff. You got too much of a good memory for me because I can't remember half that stuff. A uh, short guy balding a little bit. I don't remember. He, yeah, he, he, he would rear back like he was falling asleep, and he was on my channel. There. They just sat there on my channel. No, on his channel. Oh, I don't know. Do you know King uh, Morgan? Mm-mm. Well, welcome, Short King Baldwin. Morgan. Hello. Happy Thursday to you as well. Oh, gosh. Hello, Hi, Jenny Jenny Carlson. How welcome, are you? Welcome, everyone. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you for coming. Jenny, hey, how but, are you? But, Mike, I think that's who, I think that's who you're talking, I think we're talking about the same guy. He was sort of blonde headish, but it wasn't very blonde. I mean, it was like a dirty blonde. You know what I mean? No clue who you're talking about. I'm just going to check in. Vanessa said to behave now. Uh, uh, who's acting up? I want to know who's acting up to behave. Ain't nobody Not being me. mean. Ain't nobody being mean around here. What are you talking about? I'm sure you've already answered this, but where are the witch girl images from? Um, her name is Sweet Pea Curiosities. Did you get that, Jenny? Sweet, Sweet Pea. P-E-A, like peas. Sweet Peas Curiosity on Etsy. She's on YouTube, too, as Sweet Pea Curiosity. Uh, Carrie, he's right below you, giving a thumbs up. I see him, too. I want to know, how does it feel to be a king? Why is my chat coming up twice? That's how does it feel me. to be a king? I have eyes in the chat. All right, mom. Right. Chains, chains, shackles, and chains. No matter what it takes, someday I'm gonna break these chains. Chains. Shackles, the only one you need to worry about is Penny. You don't see him? He's up there. He's, He's up, there. up there. He's up there. Uh, Vanessa can't see Jeannie. Well, y'all need to refresh. Yeah, King Morgan commented at 3.36 p.m. Mm-hmm. Well, happy Thursday. Mm-hmm. King, if you're still here, can you type something in the chat? They don't believe you're here. They can't see you. They think reason. you're a ghost, Mr. King. <gasps> Can you imagine a ghost up in our panel? <laughs> Did you see what Mike said? Huh. It ain't coffee. It ain't coffee. I, I, I guarantee you that. <laughs> I don't drink coffee. Well... Right, it's got to be. I'm drinking um, zero sugar Dr. Pepper. I like Mike's hard lemonade. It might be the Mike card, that's what it is. She just answered you. The Mike Nona said, I'm here. Hi, Nona. She's been here. What's what's Mandy's new channel called? Are you getting double chat, you say? Is it what you said? Okay, oh. I won't carry, but. Uh, King Morgan hasn't typed yet. Just that the one. That motherfucker right there is not real. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
I had to. <laughs> <laughs> speed, a, speed is called speed high king. There, hey, hey, there's King Morgan. He's still here. He is real. <laughs> <laughs> he said, Mike said it's called Spirit Seeker Squad. Spirit Seeker Squad. Okay. I'll have to go check her out. No, we're not streaming on more than one channel, it's just one. Nona said, my fur babies are trying to walk all over me. Uh-oh, you better get up out of the floor then. Yes, we are. They take every other week. Explain that, May, to Mr. Mike. So every other week, so starting tomorrow, we rotate here. Uh, tomorrow will be in the, uh, my channel for, at 7 o'clock. So Monday through Thursday, we rotate. Um, Monday through Thursday, we come on at 2 Eastern, 1 Central. Um, and so forth. <laughs> yeah. 2 Eastern, 1 Central, 12 Mountain, 11, P, 11 a.m. Sorry. Sorry, I'm trying to concentrate. 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, Monday through Thursday. Um, Friday and Saturday, we come in at 8 Eastern, 7 Central, 6 Mountain, 5 Pacific Standard Time. On the weekend. Uh, yeah. On the weekend. But we rotate. So this uh, this week, Monday through Thursday, we are in Vanessa's. Starting tomorrow, Friday, Saturday, all the way through Thursday, it will be on my channel. And then the following week will be on Vanessa's channel. So tomorrow at 7 central will be on my channel and then we'll we'll take a break on sunday and rest and then monday will be on my channel vanessa it is jenny carlson uh crafting on a budget yes did you ask me a question uh, Nona says she's in the bed resting. Okay. Get plenty of rest. Are your legs still hurting you? No, it's YouTube. Nona, it's on YouTube. Nona, did you ever get your YouTube channel figured out? Tomorrow, I'm going to start working on my witch, though, on my channel. And I'm not sure. Uh, I'm gonna, so. Mike said that's that's the channel he's watching now. We're not on. No, it's Vanessa's channel, aren't we? No, it's Vanessa's channel. We're on Vanessa's, not mine. Angel Rose Design. Am I right? And Carrie's not seeing no. What's wrong with you, woman? What's wrong with you all? You can't see each other. Nona says she's been having seizures. He said he's oh, on crafting no. with a budget. Really? Hold on, I'm going to look. Listen, Linda, listen. <laughs> I didn't know we can do that. I know it I... Is it is on crafting on a budget. No way. Is it on Vanessa's? No, it says crafting on a budget. It says, May, you are streaming live also. I am? <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> No I didn't know. Lulu says go check. Oh that my explains. god. Hold on. I'm <laughs> okay, so I saw you. 
And it says Vanessa too. What? I see Vanessa it says Vanessa Angel Rose Designs. And then you go to Crafting on a Budget. Yes. We're supposed to be on Vanessa's channel. Yes. Yeah. But look, we can go on both channels. And you're live on your channel. But oh, that's so crazy. It, so does that mean that I can switch over to your channel and I can carry on? Yeah. <laughs> so I didn't know that. Of, there's 16 people watching. <laughs> All right, Mike. He says I see Nona now, and I can see King Morgan. Uh, that's why they can't see each other. They're on different channels. <laughs> <laughs> well, we learned something new today that we didn't know was happening. Who, who is chatting over on the, on May's channel? I, I want to know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that is weird. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> No wonder we got 19 people watching. <laughs> we got two channels watching. <laughs> that is weird. Well, hello, wherever you are. <laughs> wherever you're watching from. That is weird. Mega weird. <laughs> yep. I told y'all you were dual streaming. I didn't know. Oh, wow. Harry said, okay, that's why I can't see anyone. Mace Channel only has seven people. <laughs> well, if you want to come in chat and you're watching on Mace Channel, come over to Angel Rose Designs and you can chat with us and mm -hmm. we will see your and we'll see your chat. I'm over on May's channel. <laughs> that is weird. I didn't know you could do that. So well, have if you you're wondering doing... why I wasn't reading your chat, it wasn't that I was ignoring you. I just. We are streaming in two and we did not know that that was possible. That's why he said we were drinking something, had something in our coffee. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. Uh, Carrie said, I'm sticking to my buddy's channel. I'm going back to crafting on a budget with the cool kids. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. Are you saying I'm not cool? She's cool like that. She's cool like that. I'm very cool. We were going to do a, um, but I think I might change my mind. That was here. May. That was May that said that. May said what? She's cool like that. She's cool like that. Mm hmm. Jenny Carlson said, I commented on May's channel. Ah, well, make sure you guys comment on my channel afterwards, guys. I really appreciate comments afterwards. Right. May said, Vanessa said, May, it's the way I set it up. Oh, I didn't know that. Well, well, thank you for, for well, you know what? It would have been nice if you warned us because we're <laughs> like trying to it figure records, this out. It records on both channels and Carrie said, yes, I'm on my channel. And we weren't said, warned, I guys. We were not warned. Vanessa did not warn us. I didn't know I was being double, double troubled. Oh, Lord. I'm in double trouble. She in trouble, trouble, double. I can't even speak. Well, no wonder Mike was what? I'm like, Mike, what? I thought he was one of <laughs> Vanessa. I'm like, what? Terry said, <laughs> Mike, I thought I was going crazy. <laughs> well, guys, tomorrow, you guys remember, let me find my phone, if I can find, let me mute myself. I'm going to, you guys remember when I did the primitive doll a couple years ago and the witch's boots and the witch's hat? That's where we're going to be going again because someone stole my original. Y'all know I like witchy things said, like I that. I said hi on Vanessa's channel. I didn't see it.
Well, I'm just reading it as it comes. I don't know whose channel I'm on, I guess. I think that kind of covers that up. Vanessa got me confused, Carrie said. Vanessa confused all of us today. I, just, I didn't know. I she, did likes, know. she likes that sneaky stuff, don't she? She likes yeah, sneaking I know. off. She likes she, sneaking she... in. On StreamYard, the chats are together for you guys on panel. Okay, that's why I'm reading out everyone's... Uh, I don't know how that works, but... Yeah, I don't that's either. Why I, that's why I can see everybody's, I guess. That's good to know. I really didn't know we were streaming on two channels. <laughs> that confused me. And I'm like, huh? I didn't know Vanessa. I was like, I didn't know Vanessa knew the Well, I know that, but when we're on we're on your channel, it don't record on Vanessa's channel. She's got us blocked. She has us blocked, May. <laughs> we're on your channel. She blocks us, don't she? Mm -hmm. uh, we can't, we can't be out. nice right that's why we, she's we have, got us blocked we have to be um we have to be very nice on vanessa's channel yeah she's got us in shackles and chains mm -hmm. sometimes she falls asleep sometimes she falls asleep <laughs> she falls asleep not penny she <laughs> falls asleep and we have fun <laughs> Uh, Mike says, so I do apologize. Apparently, you're not drunk after all. <laughs> she might be. You, you just don't know. She might have been drinking that Mike's hard <laughs> lemonade. Don't, don't, don't let, don't let on her that easily because she could be on Mike's hard lemonade. <laughs> She's not that innocent. How many have you had today, um, Penny? None. 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 I, hey, the chant, the the the. the the show was over when I fell asleep. Or just about over anyway, right? You fell asleep at the front. You fell asleep at the front of the show. I fell asleep at the last of the show. A big difference. Right, Miss May? Mm-hmm. If you mm -hmm. fall asleep at the front, that, that gives us room to lollygag. <laughs> Vanessa said I have receipts that Miss Penny falls asleep on the live I have her snoring <laughs> and Mike said and I get no idea where I met May probably from Vanessa Mike, oh, Carrie wants to know, May, how was your Big Mac? My what? Your Big Mac. Oh, it was good. I was like, how do you know I ate a Big Mac? Because you told us. <laughs> oh, that would be pretty I, there. I actually said, I'm back, and that was one big load of laundry. Yes, you've been gone a while. Ooh. We were confused there for a bit, Ashley. So you missed out on a lot because we were trying to figure out how we had two streamings going on vanessa didn't warn us what did mike say when he said i get no idea where i met may probably from vanessa 
No, I think we met from um, Mandy. 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 I think that's where we met, Mike. Mandy was the person that introduced us. I believe. And I'm going to say cool that won both of them. Carrie said, May, you left us yesterday to go eat. I did, didn't I? I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you, KK. <laughs> what did KK say? We don't need to keep receipts among friends. The evidence, it's in the sauce. Hmm. Trying to figure out this, and I'm trying. I like that one, but I don't know. Let's see. That means erase the snoring. That's what she's saying. Yes. No, that's not going to go there. Yeah, I know what Vanessa's going to say. That ain't going to happen. Vanessa's going to yell at us. Gonna yell at us. Mm -hmm. Vanessa's gonna, she's gonna come and lay down the hammer on us. We're behaving. We're behaving. We're behaving. We only, we only messed up once. <laughs> I Ooh. think I'm to you the hot flashes, but boy, do I feel like I had one. It keeps doing double chat for me. I don't know why. It must be the doubles. Uh, Vanessa oh, said, Miss Penny, you are too much. I can't with you. Thank you, Miss <laughs> Vanessa. And then KK, she's a flip flopper. Look yeah. at her. No, no, keep the evidence. Let people find it on their own. <laughs> Hey, that's not friends keeping receipts. That's saying that the evidence is there. You look for yourself. <laughs> well, if she don't keep the receipt, how are they going to find it? Oh, it's in she the video. Said, okay, Vanessa said, y'all are good. Thank you. Thank and you, Vanessa. <laughs> my question, know: does Vanessa's husband still show up now and then? <laughs> <laughs> Who, fart cast break? <laughs> Vanessa. Does your husband show up now, ma'am? Vanessa, Mike wants to know. She liked it, fart cast break. Fart cast break? Nona said, I just found out about what you about what you're streaming <laughs> uh, i mean mike no, no. mr fartman left a really nice impression on vanessa <laughs> <laughs> mr leprechaun left a big impression on me <laughs> oh lord lord come on now <laughs> vanessa said what the crap mark <laughs> Carrie said, I thought Vanessa wasn't married anymore. <laughs> She's not. Oh, Lord. She's not. She's not married. How long has she been divorced? Vanessa? Uh -huh. How long have you been divorced? I don't like that one either. Not long <laughs> enough. Not long enough. I'm just saying, not long enough. Vanessa said, Mike, you are fired. Oh, Mike. You in trouble now? He said that could be Ooh. Carrie. Ooh. You done and did it. Well, Carrie, you have to come over here on Vanessa's channel to see all the comments. Put some uh, Vanessa says I am. It married. What? Oh, I ain't married. 
I think that's what she tried to say. I ain't uh, married. Well, it says it. <laughs> That that right there tells you angry text. <laughs> I'm not married. I am blank. She's not married, guys. Well, Let's get it right. She, she says she is. <laughs> I'm just she reading what it says. Text. I'm just reading what it says. <laughs> She's been divorced for nine years. Cap. Carrie, open another tab and pop out that chat. Pat's still looking. <laughs> Nona said. <laughs> looking for what? Marriage. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh. There's, I already said bachelorette number one is uh, Penny. No Penny. And bachelorette number two is Lulu. Any other bachelorettes? Any other bachelorettes? I think Nona's trying to get get rid of. I thought Pat. it was Carrie, but didn't Carrie say she went? She was already married. Carrie's married. Okay. But Carrie was the one that was asking all the questions. Remember? Yeah, but she married. Okay. Can't she just be curious? <laughs> no, she's not curious. <laughs> Vanessa's blaming it on auto correct. <laughs> She's not curious in any shape or form. Carrie said, okay, Kim, I'm going to answer the channel. I'm, I'm going to answer for Carrie, right, Carrie? You're not you're not curious. She was just asking for me, I believe. Vanessa said, oh, Lord. Who's Kim? I don't know. Carrie said, okay, Kim. I don't Kim. see him. Yeah. These people's got me going crazy, y'all. Yeah, okay. mm -hmm. This double chat thing's crazy. I have to pick only good looking men. Well, do you see what Carrie said? What'd she say? She said, I have to pick only good looking men for penny i've caused enough havoc in one place now <laughs> <laughs> i'm gonna see who is kim over on vanessa's channel or that she's playing with us i agree with lulu i'm staying out of this mess lulu said leave me out of that mess i've had enough of that nonsense <laughs> you, you are automatically enrolled in the program. <laughs> you are not left out of this. You Lulu. are automatically enrolled in the program. You are you are part of the program. Penny has you already have... been talking with him. Pat is my brother. Oh, Penny. You just got Penny. ratted out. Hey, I I've only friends. talked to him when you all were there. Hold up. Friends uh -huh. You've been friends. talking to him and not telling us? Holding out on no, secrets. No, 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 no. I've only talked to him while you all were there. <laughs> That's not what Pat's saying. Uh, Carrie said no. It's supposed to say I'm on Vanessa's channel now. You all make your mind up. I'm so confused. I think they're just messing with us now because we didn't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know who Kim is, uh, Carrie. <laughs> I don't Vanessa see a Kim. I don't see a Kim either. I'm over on Vanessa's channel. I didn't see a Kim. So, Kim, if you're on Vanessa's channel, can you comment? I'm watching right now. This is your opportunity to make yourself known. Kim. Unless she's spelling Mike backwards. The K-I-M. <laughs> well, it would be E Kim F to Swa. <laughs> and she said, Carrie says, I don't see Mike's comments anymore. Wonder why? Because he's there. He's Mike's comments. He's saying, shh. shh. <laughs> he's don't messing tell. with y'all. Mike is don't messing tell. with y'all. Y'all don't tell. 
Terry, I'm right here. <laughs> Anybody show up at my door is going to be met by my bat. Bit, <laughs> met by a bat. <laughs> yeah, Mike said, Terry, I'm right here. Right here. You see me? Right here. Oh, she's blowing kisses at Mike. Now, now. Ooh. Come to my door. You better make sure you're right with Jesus. <laughs> I don't and have Jesus. a door. I don't have a door. I just have windows. <laughs> Carrie's like, I can oh. hear you. I well, you. I know it's not on my door because I'm married. What's no, that three Wash hands. What's wash One hands? man is enough for my lifetime, y'all. KK, I can hear you. I agree. I got enough with what I got. I can't even handle what I have. Let it go in another one. <laughs> right? I got the patience for another man. Uh uh. They they too needy. Yes, I agree. They act like babies when they're sick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I got cold. Uh, what? Mike says, "What's Mary got <laughs> to do with this?" <laughs> um, because who was it who said they didn't want a man in chat? Hold on, what did they say about man? Lulu. Lulu. Yeah, that's what we're talking about, Mike. Get with the program. Catch up. <laughs> He's talking about y'all. <laughs> we get a call we have to do laundry cook dinner take care of the kids do all the car rides and they get a cold they're in the bed crying like a little baby yep <laughs> vanessa said y'all need jesus i have jesus you know, jesus needs us jesus needs us no one is cussing somebody out no, no. Who are you cussing at, girl? Ain't that serious? <laughs> <laughs> it is never that serious. <laughs> I like this one better. Than we are <laughs> oh, wow, she just like so. That's why I don't have kids. I'm not sharing my wife's attention with anyone. <laughs> oh, Nona said, maybe she's looking. <laughs> Did I miss? <laughs> you and me both, Penny. Ashley said, I'm lucky my husband helps me with laundry, cooking, and dishes. My gripe is he's moody all the time. <laughs> right, I moody, swear, moody. men are probably like, more like a female than we are females. They got hormones too, or more, or not hormones. They need to get, they got they need to get that balance. Testosterone or whatever it is. I call it man PMS. <laughs> you need men's, a tampon? Men's <laughs> PMS is worse than women's PMS. Right? They, they need diapers too. <laughs> hey, Mike. Mike, you need a tampon? <laughs> Mike, you don't know what you just walked into the lion's den. <laughs> You just walked into the lion's den. Oh. <laughs> oh. I do that too, that Ashley. Just not laundry. I'm not allowed. I don't separate nothing. 
<laughs> it just goes it all in at once. <laughs> and your white shirt comes out pink. <laughs> <laughs> he said only to get catch and hold grease. <laughs> hey, that's wasted money. It does work though. Oh Lord. <laughs> Vanessa said, Ashley, your husband has PMS. <laughs> oh, and he I forgot. He he capitalized the whole word nothing. <laughs> what is it, curry paste? Um, Midal, if you're watching this channel, come sponsor us. We'll tell the men that they need Midal for their service. Midal. Midal. <laughs> it's to control PMS. Notice that I'm lost. Well, Nona. We're talking about Mike doing laundry. He don't separate the laundry. He puts everything. He don't separate nothing, he said. He puts it all <laughs> in at once. He puts like, it all in at once. I got to read what Mike said. <laughs> you're like, you do that on purpose or you're not told <laughs> She had to wear a tampon. It got stuck. She doesn't call them tampons. She calls them tampons. <laughs> I've never heard that. Never heard of that. <laughs> Ashley said, laugh out loud. I don't fold socks. I just throw them in the basket for everyone to get when they need them. <laughs> Nona said bye and hugs. Oh, have a good day, Miss. Have a good, good day, Don. I hope you feel better. Yes. Oh, bye, Ashley. She's got to go. Kids are off the bus. Oh, have a good day, Ashley. Oh, we're starting, Ashley. You can't go nowhere. We're just starting. No, just kidding. <laughs> I know. We're just getting started. Y'all just now got me laughing. <laughs> Uh, Mike, do you Mike, do you happen to hunt? <laughs> Does Mike hunt? Depends on what what he's hunting for. You have to be specific. Game. He's hunting for the tampons. <laughs> Need a tampon? <laughs> Mike, are you hunting for those tampons? <laughs> yes, very avidly. Okay. What my husband does with the tampons, he dips them in dough urine, and he drags his mood swings Probably behind him. That stuff stinks. God, that stuff stinks. Yeah. What do you think about this, uh, Penny? Hold on. Tampons? Tampons. Okay, hold on. What about like that? Oh, wait. I, don't, I can't see you. I know because I'm over on Vanessa's channel, paying attention on Vanessa's oh. channel. Bring it down towards you a little bit. I swear, I don't know how many times I fix this camera, and every time that I fix it, I get the good angle, and then. Yeah, I like it. Okay. Hold on. Okay. I own a very large camera. I don't need to drag dough urine around. Okay. <laughs> now that's to cover your scent. Uh, he does it to cover his scent up. I but, know. Uh, He's saying he can shoot out his window. He don't need to go out in the woods. That ain't hunting. That's, <laughs> that's hunting. Like, hey, that's a, that's about right where I live here. You could shoot that's him out the hunt. window. <laughs> I showed you all the deer the other day, right out the window. 
who needs to go climb in the woods up a tree <laughs> in the cold <laughs> that's cheating that's a lazy hunting oh. i'll say well i we have 11 acres so <clears throat> he climbs up in a tree He's falling out of a tree before. He said, this is North Dakota. It's flat, flat, flat here. <laughs> Did he say flat? <laughs> How many flats was that? <laughs> Too many flats. <laughs> North Dakota. Man, I bet that's cold. Gosh. It is cold. We, used to, we were Ooh. stationed there before. Ooh, how can you stand it? Oh, my bones hurt just thinking about it. It is cold over there. What the heck? Is North Dakota flat? I thought, where, where does the mountain start? It is flat. <laughs> Obviously not near him. <laughs> <laughs> it's very flat in North Dakota. Wow, me, Miss. And I need that smaller. Kansas, Kansas is flat. That's where they get a lot of tornadoes and stuff. I like it. Yeah, I like it. I don't yeah. know. It just it needs something. I like, right. I feel like it's missing something. Maybe you need to put that together and put a charm dangling down or something. It needs something. Yeah, a, a piece of jewelry or something. Or something dangling from her hat, maybe. I don't know. Missing something. It's missing that oof. Mm-hmm. What about like that? Did the camera that's the wrong color. In? It needs it there, but it's the wrong color. That it blends in. Off. It blends in too much. That looks better. I like it better, don't you? I like it color better. What if I did? Yeah, I like it. It's so flat here, you can watch your dog run away for two weeks before you go to get <laughs> You gotta be sad. <laughs> Oh my goodness. That's a little exaggeration on that. <laughs> a little. <laughs> Is it North Dakota or South Dakota that has the, a lot of the the Indian reservations? North Dakota does have some. Okay. I wouldn't say, I mean, well, no, wait. South Dakota has Indian reservations. Okay. Um. I mean, Mike can answer because he's from there. Bless his heart. Mm, I'm, I'm having such a hard time. Uh, we farm 14,000 acres up here, so I don't have a need to cover myself in deer pee because deer can't smell that. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. They can't smell that far. <laughs> <laughs> Both have reservations. Okay, where's yeah. uh where's that mount is Mount Rushmore in north or south? South. Okay, south. That I do know. Oh yes, yeah. South Dakota has the Black Hills where mm -hmm, oh, the Black oh, Hills Rose Gold. What part of North Dakota are you uh, from, Mike? We lived in Minot when we were stationed there. Where my husband was stationed there. I mean, we were there with him. They look like, on the map, they look like they're pretty big states. 
when, when we left, it was colder than hell. We have not been back since then. Is that where you said that you uh, went out on the road and the, uh, the battery died or something? Or car mm -hmm. died? Oh, yeah. man. Jamestown is the biggest, closest town you'd know. You know where Jamestown is? Probably not. I'm horrible with directions and yeah, I have no sense of direction. None whatsoever. Nada. Well, you know what? He's got enough for us to go up there and pitch tents and have a craft craft a lamp, craft fair, couldn't we? Yeah, he would never see us either. Well, Penny, you invite yourself everywhere, huh? <laughs> <laughs> You've done inviting yourself. I just want out of this town. I just want out of this town. Right, you're be you have a beautiful town. <laughs> he's in biz he's in between Bismarck and Fargo. Oh, okay. We've been to Fargo and Bismarck. I wasn't going to his house. I was just going on his farm. <laughs> <laughs> We start it's like at it was worth a try. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to go to leave. we're going to Switzerland, uh, Greece, and North Dakota. <laughs> better make room for us, Mike. You better let your wife know we're coming. First of all, <laughs> I think that's where what it needs. What's all them women out there for? <laughs> I think that's where it needs to start. Let the wife know. <laughs> well, come knocking out. Can we borrow some glue? <laughs> <laughs> Who are you? Well, you know, uh, Mike invited us. <laughs> Vanessa said Mike gets lost in her house. <laughs> now, now, Vanessa. Be nice. He said, don't come in the winter. You'll end up here for seven months. Oh, Lord, that'd be too much. I couldn't come in the winter. I couldn't handle the cold. Oh, my God. That place it's is below extremely, zero. It's below zero. It is extremely cold. He's right. You don't want to go in the winter time because it starts to snow. Well, I don't. does it ever stop snowing? That's the question, I guess. <laughs> it never stops snowing. We had snow it's covered right up, covering up winds. the windows. It's right there at those Canadian yeah. winds, ain't it? Yes, yes. Oh, my God. That was horrible. Wow. I guess you have to be stocked up there. Oh, yes. It starts to snow from the moment you wake up to the moment you go to bed. It never, it never stops snowing, that damn place. Wow. Even in June, it snowed. Wow. I wouldn't knock it out. I mean, snow's pretty, but I like it come and go, you know. <laughs> we had window, the snow covered up the window. We had to go out through the back door because the front door was covered up. Oh, goodness gracious. That's we have pictures of us. We have pictures of us shoveling that snow. <laughs> it stops during road construction season for four months. <laughs> How does it know it, it's having road construction? It, it's you that bad. You can't, even, you can't even shut your cars off in the winter. You have to keep the car running. Oh, wow. It frees up, wouldn't it? Yeah. You, you mean antifreeze freeze don't exactly. work? There's no such thing as I don't I, I don't think it recognizes antifreeze. It's non-existent. Wow. You, gotta have, you gotta have your car on. Um, you better make sure it, the garage is still up because it get carbon monoxide. <laughs> oh Lord have mercy. That makes me hurt. Ooh. If you like cold, go to North Dakota. If no. you don't like the cold, stay away from North Dakota. No, I don't like cold. Yeah, we spend weeks at 50 and 60 below. Oh, my God. Are you kidding? 
Yeah, when we left in 2010, Ooh. it was negative 57. Negative. Carrie said, oh, heck no. Yeah, when we left in 2010, it was negative, negative 57. Oh, my God. No, 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 no. My, eye, well, my eyeballs would freeze. Your hair nostrils will freeze. Right. It was that cold when we left. Man, I had God. never experienced cold like that. Oh, my God. How'd you stand it, May? With your I bones. I was depressed. That was the most depressing time. I mean, aside from the fact that my mother had died while we were there. Oh, but goodness. I don't see how you stood it. It was horrible. It was depressing. I want, you know, you often wonder, like, no. which state has the most. Uh, suicides. I bet that would be one of them. It is. It is. Actually, they have a lot of drinking and suicide because the sun doesn't go down. I remember Well, I heard um, that the Indians you know, if they leave the reservation they don't get their pension and so all they can do is sit there and drink. Mm -hmm. um, the uh, I remember that uh, there was a lot of in the base there was suicide but a lot of the young airmen would start drinking wow. especially if that was like it's a career killer oh, on the military Lord. that's your first duty assignment it's a missile they have the missiles there oh lord where you need to be aware and then here you get mm -hmm. She is One about to come out. Okay, Vanessa. She's going to drop off her niece's daughter. She's a taxi today. Taxi Vanessa. She's the Uber. She's the Uber. <laughs> the Uber driver. <laughs> you, hear, you hear about it, uh, the Minot Air Force Base made China bought all the land around it and the bait uh, and it, they had to reclaim. What? Oh, my God. China, how the hell they managed to do that? See what I mean? This country is so fucked up. How in the world did they allow China where there's missiles in that base? That's there is what missiles in my mind. May, that's what I was telling you about up there in, in the... Uh, I had to tell my husband that. Hey, Rhode Eric. Island. Where is it? Uh, May, where was I telling you they was wanting to put all the amount? Those Man, that's scary. That's very scary because that's... New Jersey. Up here at New Jersey because they had... And it was a base that had our uh, computers and our intelligence and stuff. And Let me tell my husband. Hold on. Hey, Eric. Um, one Can of I my uh, subscribers oh, here, my God. Mine, he lives in Minot. He said that some of the land around Minot Air Force Base was purchased by China, and it has. He said that it has missiles in the land that they bought. Yeah, we're also saying that about the other in California too. Yeah, I told you, them China's buying up land everywhere. Property everywhere. Right. It's making no sense because you can't buy property there. That's scary that they're doing that. Well, it's because yeah, our is. government's letting them. Huh. Yeah. It makes you wonder. It's crazy. I think Biden is in cahoots with China. I really do. That's crazy. It makes me so mad. It makes me so mad. I want to scream. Scream, hey, go ahead. Up, scream. America, wake up. Scream, Penny, scream. Gonna be it makes back. me want to go over and get in cahoots with Kim Jong Un or whatever. or whatever, you know? That's scary that they bought it does th make that. Me... That base has got a lot of missile. A lot. You know what, May? It does make it upsets me so much that it makes me want. To go and run for either senator or, or 
congressman. It really does. Well, you know what? You can r run and make it because look, uh, Borbid didn't even she she failed her GED like what four times. <laughs> well, look at the one it married. It's married their brother. GED, uh, Bo uh, Lauren Borbid. She didn't. She got. Uh, she she failed her GED four times. Wow. And she was in. She was a. Uh, uh, high school dropout. Uh, and just before she decided to run, she she tried to do her GED and she failed it four times. Mike so it doesn't I matter. Have, Mike says I got a bunch of missile silos on my land. Really? It makes you wonder. That's the only way that blue collar people need to start running. Right. It makes me want yeah. to go Anybody. and try. It makes me want to try. It makes it makes it makes you wonder, like. I thought that you had to be very super educated, you I know, do too, um, do uh, either doctors uh -uh. or doctor, or maybe you know, yeah, like a lawyer, somebody with some type that knows how to run a freaking you know sense. country. Hell, I got common sense. I don't. Ha I mean, I might not have a professional kind of sense, but I at least got common sense, you know. Right. Well, the best, the first thing that you could do to learn about the politics and in and out is like that. If you have like a local board. Um, I mean, I watch it daily. I that. watch, I watch it daily and I'm so aggravated right now. I can't stand it over at money. I cannot stand it. I mean, here, uh, oh, here's what it was. It was $400 billion for the world. Uh, disaster right we're giving 400 billion dollars to our to the world disaster for any country that has a disaster right guess how Can't much guess how much america has in their disaster fund right now zero zero, zero. the Why people had a disaster play? in hawaii Florida has disasters, and right. people say, well, if you live in Florida, you're rich. Mm -hmm. That's not always the yeah, case. No they have trailer parks, too. You know what I mean? Uh, and a lot of people don't have the insurance the down there. And then have, like, $400 billion dollars we are like given to the disaster fund for the world. For it don't countries. make sense. It don't make yeah, sense. Yeah. And guess who's bringing up? No, hey, guess who's bringing up a debate de to debate that? The congressman from Texas. He's like, you know, we've got people, we've got veterans in the streets, we've got, we've got children that don't have enough to eat, we've got families that can't afford to buy food for their families. Mm -hmm. We need to take care of America first, he said. He said, whoever, this is America I last. I agree. I'll rub them if I want to. <laughs> what? Why okay? would you live in a place where a hurricane destroys your house every other year? Maybe that's the only reason they don't have the funds to move any other place. They were born there. Hello? Did y'all hear my husband? Yeah. yeah. What did he say? <laughs> Vanessa, calm me down. Vanessa, I'm in trouble. Did he come in and start rubbing his nipples? He goes, they are my nipples and I will rub them. What? <laughs> Yeah. Oh my. <laughs> he wants you to rub his nipples. Did I hear that right? No, I can rub them myself. <laughs> <laughs> the last time we had someone rubbing their nipples, their their wife uh, posted them all over a dating site. Uh, uh, the 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 gay sites. The gay he got sites. a thousand hits. He said, no, he can rub his own nipples. He said, I'm rubbing myself. That wasn't Eric. No, that's not Eric. That's KK's uh, Raymond or whatever. <laughs> oh, 
I'm looking for a paper tiger count. Yo, bad. Where'd it go? Can you believe Vanessa called me down? She did what? She called me down. What'd she say? To quit talking politics. Uh, Mike said, I got some uh, bag bomb for my cows' nipples if you need it. <laughs> hey, <yeah. laughs> Carrie said, KK, you said he's rubbing his nipples. I saw he wanted to rub yours. <laughs> I don't know. She went silent for a minute there. <laughs> she, she, she. She I'm going to read it to him. Carrie said, KK, you said your husband, he's rubbing his nipples. I thought he wanted to rub yours. <laughs> he's allergic. What? Who's the youngest? <laughs> I'm allergic. Oh. <laughs> I thought he said, who's the youngest? <laughs> She's allergic to rubbing nipples? You nipple. Really, my nipples are allergic. <laughs> you nipple sucker. <laughs> he left. He does, he like, you should have read what Mike said. What did Mike say? Before he gets put on the. Uh, 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 Mike said, I mean, it's probably true. Need it. Raymond! <laughs> Mike said, I mean, it's probably true. <laughs> hey, Beverly! Hey, Beverly! Uh, WTF Mike says he's got some bag bomb for cow's nipples. You want some? Batter, batter. <laughs> Mike said he's got some bag bomb for your nip cow nipples. Do he's got some, some. He's got some nether batter. <laughs> he said, you said, what do the ladies got? Cow nipples? <laughs> He said he would like to see that. <laughs> I don't like the stars anymore. I saw stars dancing on the water. It's not even the stars, really. It's the yellow. I don't like the yellow. I like yellow. I know, but... It need a hey, put some put some uh you got any buffing rub or something you can put on it to tone it down, <laughs> make it make it a little dark duller instead of so bright. What the yellow? Yeah. Yeah, maybe go over some vintage photos. Go over it with vintage photos or something. I'm going to I'm gonna have to look, I'm gonna have to take a picture of my screen so I can read that to Raymond later, Mike. <laughs> I I'm legit taking a photo. Uh Nipples, nipples make guys, guys squat. Your hunting instinct kicks in. Shh. There's some nipples. <laughs> I'm hoping I can uh, hide the... I was about to say hide the nipples. <laughs> hide some of this yellow. Be very, very quiet. I'm hunting nipples. <laughs> nipple hunting, nipple hunting. On this episode of Mike's Hunting Nipples. <laughs> we'll show you how to be very quiet. <laughs> These are big, big ones. I'm gonna put this Look, it's the most dangerous set of nipples in the world. I'm gonna poke it with a stick. You're gonna poke it with a stick. Uh -huh. <laughs> Be very, very quiet. That's Elmer Fudd. It says that. Be very, really quiet. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. That's so much better. 
I do raise a foot, but like Vanessa, you can't blame this on me. These now, don't that look bad? No, 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 Mike. Yeah, that makes uh -uh. it look better. Yeah, it does. I'm wondering if I did it as a flip or maybe have it to where it's like a pendulum. Open up to the stars. Uh-huh. I see stars. <laughs> and don't she have stars on her hat? Nope. Oh. I can make one. I'm bla It's always the man's fault, so it's Mike's fault, y'all. Yeah, blame it on Mike. Mike did it. Okay, so we're not doing stars on the back. I'm covering that because I don't want that yellow. I'll leave the yellow there. That would leave it on Mike. This bunch of ladies are crazy fun. No, 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 no. We just fun. <laughs> Lying. Lying. <laughs> we put the F in fun. <laughs> I thought you were going to say something else, Penny. I was like, I was like Vanessa's definitely putting you in timeout. This, this chat has, has gone completely sideways. <laughs> If you let me, if you let Miss Penny run the chat, that's what it you're gonna get. around the curve. I'll take you around the curve and back. <laughs> but I honestly think people love Miss Penny's chatter, chatter and laughter. So <laughs> it just makes me think of a carnival ride when he said it goes sideways. <laughs> the tilt the world. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'm focused sometimes. That on used to be my favorite ride was the tilt -to world. You know, the half yeah. half circle thing you sit in, it's uh -huh. it goes around and <laughs> I don't know. As I right, what do you think about this. I like mm -hmm. it. I like it a lot. Yeah, I like it. Oh, well, that's cute. Yes, that is so cute with the strings hanging out. I like it. Or the fabric or whatever. Mm -hmm. Might say. <laughs> oh, ask me what? What I do? <laughs> I get in trouble when I don't mean to. <laughs> she get in trouble even if she's not trying to. <laughs> even if I'm solid. <laughs> what you say, even if I'm solid? <laughs> what the hell does that mean? Even when if is I'm that? Solid? When is that ever happening? <laughs> I think I think it's because she meant to say silent. She said solid instead of silent. <laughs> Carrie said, "Looks great, May." Thank you. <laughs> Name, what, the state, like... name all the states the Mississippi River runs through. Oh. Well, one being Mississippi. <laughs> Tennessee. Ohio. But I don't know on the other side. Arkansas. What goes up through there? Arkansas. What's above Arkansas? That state. She said that state. Yep. <laughs> I don't think you ever get in trouble. It's more of the permanent residence. <laughs> yeah, she is a permanent resident. <laughs> You're right about that one. She I'm is a permanent working, resident. I, I'm just working on the night shift. <laughs> <laughs> working on the night shift, baby.
How is that? I wish my light wasn't so. All right, Matt's got it. Minnesota, Wisconsin, Iowa, Illinois, Missouri, Kentucky, Tennessee, Arkansas, Mississippi, and Louisiana. It's Iowa that's above. Uh, Arkansas. But I didn't know Minnesota and Wisconsin. Very interesting. Alright, I need to get some book in a second. See, it looks like it's in the room. Oh, Tennessee River and the Mountain Man, we get together any time we can. It's Iowa, not Iowa. <laughs> Here's her chickens. I hear my little Serrano stroll. <laughs> oh, Mr. Nightbot, I wish you'd die. Ooh, that would have been pretty right there. Mm-hmm. Or a closure. Mm-hmm. That's pretty. Right? That would have been the closure right there. That would have been really stinking cute. Absolutely. <clears throat> looks like it's looks like it's a little uh doorknob. Well, yeah, but it looks like it's a little embellishment to her hat, you know, like mini mm. pearl. Actually, I like that one. So I might put that there. <laughs> oh, the switch. <laughs> you, would you like to name her? I'll name her your ex. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm getting ready to pull out a label. Oh, toe tag. <laughs> Time for a toe tag. Hey, uh, we need to let Mike fill out a toe tag. <laughs> Okay, let me see if I, let me locate a blank one. Should we read him all of our toe tags? No, just let him fill out one. It's already 10 to 5. Here's the label for the name. All right, this is a toe tag, Mark. Who would you like to name your toe tag? Who do you want to put on your toe tag? Fish called Wanda. Oh, it's it's called Wanda. 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 A fish called Wanda. Wanda. Fish called Wanda. Do do we want to read one to him so he knows what they yeah, are? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'll do Almond Hershey. This is a toe tag. Um, his name is Almond Hershey. Case number one eight nine six. He's eighteen. Male, race is fudge. He weighs 113 pounds and he's 5'4. 
place of death, the Titty Ding Dong Bar. The and what? <laughs> titty Ding Dong Bar. Remember, this is what the chat put. Um, date of death was 4 1 1959. Cause of death lost his nuts and Hershey squirts. Uh, his physician is Dr. Dinker. Um, the funeral director is Dingleberry's crematory and he died with a smile. That was May's input. Remember? Okay. So what do you the name, what name do you want to put on your on your toe tag? Here we'll do we need to find a girl. It's a movie. Never mind. We need a name. He's like, just kidding. It's a movie. Never mind. A fish want. Can I do? Yeah, that sounds. Is that, that is with uh, her name was Wanda? Um, is that with um? What the the guy from uh, Andy Griffin's show, um, Barney? Yeah, Barney. All right, her name's Wanda. What is her height and her weight? Well, her name could be Wanda Fisher. <laughs> Case number. Uh, three four two dash zero eight two two. Her height and her weight. Oh, good lord, she's five gotcha. three. Come on, you gotta make it funny. We know you's funny. That's a little short. Falls of death. <laughs> Slaughtered for nipples. <laughs> this is a shit. 380. <laughs> okay. Okay. What was her cause of death? Well, we need age, sex, and race. Oh. So. Okay, was she a spotted bass? Blue gill. She's probably a catfish. <laughs> <laughs> Do the Wanda. That could be Wanda right there. In her younger age. She's not a lady unless she's 380, you know. Oh, Lord. What's her race? Her sex. Well, I got this journal to work finish working on, and then I started on the chat to see this one. This is the other one I'm trying to get done. It's going to have four signatures. It's the butterfly one. So... She's NASCAR. NASCAR. Yeah. Is that cause of death? Uh, that's her race. Okay. Okay, so let me put in age, sex. I don't want to squish. So. <clears throat> race. Put her at 38. He's got a lot of 38s on her. Uh, uh, doctor's name, the funeral director, and comments. Please fill in the blanks. Make it funny. Right, you already got a race. Races NASCAR. Uh huh. Bowling. Oh God, yeah, that, that that caught up to her quick, didn't it? Huh. Zoom zoom. Zoom zoom. Boom boom. NASCAR. What was that song that came out? All I want to do is zoom 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 zoom. Then a boom boom. Just shake it up. 
<laughs> Sorry, I just thought about that. <laughs> Why is it doing double chat? Y'all see double chat? I do. I see that. It's because you're on both of them. It needs to make sure it goes on both channels. Cause of death. Um, tragically triggered. <laughs> turkey. Leg. Cause of death. Tragically shook on a turkey. Cause of death. Mm, when her horse me. blew a marsh gun and she hit the ditch. So, uh... In the turkey leg in a ditch <laughs> horse blue um, you could put that in you could put that down there in the comments okay position Zoom, 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 and a boom, boom. Oh, we need age. We need age and sex. What? Yeah, where was the ditch at? We need to place the death. Place the death. The only mountain in South Dakota. <laughs> <laughs> North. He's in North. Uh, North Dakota. Whatever. <laughs> Died in one of the mountains. One of the Dakota states. <laughs> There's Mount Rushmore in South Dakota. <laughs> Position, Dr. Wishbone. What's the name of some of y'all's funeral homes? <laughs> y'all are really morbid. <laughs> Get <on> back here. <laughs> um, oh, gosh. She died in Newfoundland. <laughs> Newfoundland. <laughs> Newfoundland. This is dildo. <laughs> dildo. My <laughs> <laughs> my <laughs> 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 1969, no, 6-9-1969. That's the hospital town, by the way. <laughs> I, live, I live in Dildo. <laughs> Golly. The physician could be Dr. Deep Throat. <laughs> she choked on a chicken turkey leg. Oh, Lord. Dr. Choking the Bird. Mr. Game, <laughs> Mr. Wild Game. <laughs> Fake bitch, 244, not enough. Race troll, wake, 250 over 52. Internet community, calls a death troll. <laughs> Physician talk, doctor talk shit. Funeral director, VDDK. Tom, it's best friend, got jokes. I thought that said best friend is Jesus. When did that? When did you make that one? That was um, the second or third show. Oh, these for Vanessa. Her occupation was tur tur <laughs> turkey fluffer. <laughs> oh, that's that's the doctor's name, Doctor Turkey Fluffer. <laughs> Gotta say that fast, Turkey Fluffer. <laughs> 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 funeral director. What's the funeral director? Wishbone crematory. <laughs> what wishbone? Oh, oh no. Race, sex is, uh, no thank you. What was her sex? <laughs> she had none. She had none. <laughs> <laughs> Glad you caught that, KK. <laughs> 
say that fast three times, Penny. I can't. Turkey Tur- fluffer. Turkey fluffer. Turkey. <laughs> Turkey fluffer, turkey fluffer, turkey fluffer. <laughs> what are we waiting on? The funeral director? Age, I'm going to put... Um... Okay, dude, six on the 9th of 1969. She identified as a biscuit and gravy mostly. <laughs> <laughs> she was like, I like biscuits and gravy. <laughs> oh, Lord. She only identified as biscuit and gravy. She identified as food. <laughs> we need a few. I say wish. Oh, gotta come up with a funny um age. Um, how long ago? Uh, I'm gonna put hundred years old. I was gonna put sixty nine. <laughs> Funeral director, fluff your pet. <laughs> fluff your feathers, crematory. Well, well now you know where the chunks come from, Penny. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Uh, fluff, fluff. Now you already got fluff on there, don't you? No, it's gonna be fluff your casket crematory. Fluff that casket. Well, I thought. What about a uh, feather, feathered pecker? T- <laughs> pecker. <laughs> pecker flavor. Oh pecker flavors. Pecker feathers. <laughs> The feather plucker, feather plucker, crematory, <laughs> feather pluckers, plucker, crematory. Okay, so Wanda Fisher, case number 342-80822, her age is 69, sex, no thank you, her race is NASCAR. Mike Hunt's crematory services. Okay. Oh, Lord. <laughs> I'm going to, I'll fix this one up so it's nice. Mike Hunt's cremation. Cremation oh. service. Oh, what about Mike Hunt's taxidermy? <laughs> taxidermy. She choked on the turkey. Services. Okay. So, um, she's 380, 5'3", place of death, Dildo, Newfoundland, date of oh death is God. June 9th. Mike, is this, is this from a movie or is this someone he knows? His ex. Cause oh of death Lord. on the turkey leg. We're good at roasting exes here. <laughs> he said We're, perfect. The physician We're, is Dr. We- turkey Fluffer. And We're really Mike's good at roasting exes here. Uh huh. Is it Mike's Hunt's crem- crem- cremation services or Mike Hunt's taxidermy services? <laughs> and then I'm going to fix this and show it on the next show. Fix tag. Fix toe tag. Next. Yeah. I'll be right back. And this is what she's going to look like. <laughs> you even got a picture. The only person I know in this story is Wanda the turkey fluffer. <laughs> okay. I'm going to put on here. Wanda. The turkey, turkey fluffer. Fluffer. 
Oh, you like you like pillow fluff? You be fluffy pillow? Okay. So this is gonna get all attached to each other. By the way, ladies, did you guys see we got the Facebook account for uh, the Leprechaun Man? Oh, the green. Oh, my God. No. Do you guys see that? Okay, so taxiturp. Taxiturp. Yep. I can just tell Mike right now, he better hope his wife don't ever divorce him and then decide to come to our channel. <laughs> right? That's mm -hmm. a totally different ex Mike's ex-wife. That's a different Mike. This is <laughs> That's Mike a different Mike. Mike. All right. I think I got I got it, guys. I got it. She nailed it. I just got to do something for the spine. Where did I put all my markers at? It looks good, May. I need my wake marker. I think for here, I'm going to make one of my bead charms, wrap it up, and then stick it there like a handle thingy. Oh, yeah. It's a girthy yes. one. I don't cut out threads, so. I don't know where yeah, my white markers are. you need one of my long boho beads to put on that spine, don't you? Yeah, like I got rid of all my boho beads, but I can make one. It doesn't take long to make a witchy boho bead. She's married to a guy with WTF on his name. She's made her terrible life choice already. <laughs> wow. He's talking about the self. Is he copying you? Thank you, Miss Patricia. So if you open it up, it goes like this. The light's not helping me here. It's a little chunky monkey. It I'm is. Call it the mini with girth. Um, I need... Oh, there it is. White marker. This is what I'm looking for. It's hard to tell with the light. My light source here is coming. See the sun. The sun. It, yeah. it, it blinds everything out, don't it? Yeah. I think I'm going to name her Stormy. Kind of hard. Storm, steamy windows. I just want to practice. I'm going to write it. Oh, that's window. pretty. I like it, Paige. Hmm. Oh, these are so cute, y'all. Oh. And then she had an x ray. Damn, that's what she looks like after she was x rayed. Before. <laughs> after. Oh, wow. Ooh, that's scary. What did I do here? Oh, that one goes like this. It flips back this way. Um, mini with girth only works for overstuffed journals. Overstuffed, yeah. Yeah, well, that's what we're doing. And this is one of my specimen cards. Oh. Now you remind it what I was doing. And then, it's hard to see. I'll have to show it when it's not so bright. You'll have to do a little separate video and put it up so that way people can view it before you go, go on the live mm -hmm. cell to sell it. Or is that one for... Yeah, like dollars? when we start tomorrow night or something. Mm -hmm. Pretty woman walking down the street. Pretty woman. Has this one. One I like to. It's hard to see. 
You all did an amazing job. He likes these journals. Thank you. So right here, I think I'm going to do one of my boho beads to put it right there like a handle. But I think I'm done. All of these will be for sale, Mike, on October the 1st. I still got a lot to do on this one to get this one ready. Then the yeah, but yours are bigger. Yours are way chunkier than mine because yours are bigger size. So you got more work to do on yours. Because you got more. Yours are bigger in size, so you got more pages to fill. Look how pretty that is. Oh, you did another one? How many you have so far? Three. Um, I'm working on two at a time. I got my butterfly one, my second, which one, and then this one. They turned so out I'm great. Doing this one. This one is gonna. This all this like, extra frame is going in that one. And then I'm working on this one, and this is the other one I'm gonna be working on. This is the. May, did you get one. my email? What email? The, I sent it to the email that you sent me the email from. Um, no, I'll have to look. Um, and that reminds me of Miss Penny. When you get a file, so let me share a screen real quick. Because you said it had the watermark. It's not really a watermark. Watch. Hold on. Mike said he has 12 journals now and he ain't used not one. Really? I use them. I, use them. I, I use don't mine. use them. Uh, KK okay. uses them. He more than 12. Let's see. So on. these are going to be my covers, but I was trying to get my printer to work so I can make them a little bit smaller so it would fit perfect on there. All right. So when you get a file, right? Miss Penny, show me your screen. Like that one. Okay. Like the one that, okay. So if I was to come in here and import it, right? And um, open in. Sorry, hold on. So here's that file. I'm being blinded by my window here. That was, which one? The past the. This one, right? Is the one you said? No. I think it's because it's not allowing me. Why is it not allowing me? Oh, I have to plug in the thingy. Oh, I don't feel like plugging that in. Oh, All right. So see how, but. Let me see if I can try. Yeah, I have to plug in my hard drive. <laughs> not, my hard said, drive's not plugged. What am I going to do with the fluffy journal? My hard drive is not plugged in, but let me see oh. if I can work on one of these. All right. So, for instance, darn it. This is the file that you need to open, right? It brought in, um, say for, Mine. they're all, all grouped in. They're all grouped up. So when I do it, I group it in, right? If mm -hmm. you select all of it like this, like, draw it in, right click mm -hmm. on your mouse and click ungroup. Mm -hmm. It will ungroup everything. Take that layer that's on the top, which is the one with the words, my mm -hmm. name on it move mm -hmm. it over okay okay because what it is it's that layer is on top of all this so just watermark uh, yeah. ungroup it click on it and ungroup it and move the watermark and you can delete that but make sure when you come back and ungroup go back here and group these because otherwise all these little um score lines if you were mm -hmm. to move it it will it will remove those you know, when you go to move it, it's going to move your score line. So make sure that's all done. But that's all, right. all you did. It's all grouped. Just unclick all of it. Ungroup that that top layer that has the. Um, okay. The, the it's not a one. The first two that, that came in, it cut half of it off. Wonder why. 
because are you on are you opening it up I'm on, on the phone. that's why it's a okay. big file so as you can see it's big it has a lot of pieces okay so the, the mat is 12 by 24 and look it's outside of the mat see you okay. got this part and you got this part so if it's on your phone it's there you just got to bring it into your silhouette or your cricket okay. and make it a little bit smaller so you can see it. you know zoom in and zoom out so you can see the entire file yeah okay it's okay. there it's just, it's just it's a big file okay I'll, I'll show more about that later on when I All plug right. in my um, hard drive. It's it's on my hard drive. I don't feel like plugging Mike it in because I might lose you guys. Mike said, I tell you, me and the Silhouette Workspace have a love-hate relationship. So does May. <laughs> no, I like Silhouette. You I do, like Silhouette. You do. I, don't, I don't like Cricket. Space. Cricket is the one I don't like. Now, silhouette I like. Right now, what's wrong is that I don't have my, my, that file is saved on my hard drive and I don't have it plugged in. If I was, because this computer is so late, uh, old, not late, old, I was to plug it in right now in the middle of this, I might lose you guys because right. it's finicky. But later on, I'll show you. Um, when I get on mine tomorrow night, I'll bring and plug it in before we go live because I have to plug it in before we go live, the hard drive. I'll yeah. show you how to remove it's It's just a layer okay okay it's just a layer you just got to ungroup it and move it out and delete that okay but yeah i'm done i just got to do my boho i thought the cricket was much more usual oh friendly. god no oh, oh my I don't god know. it don't no. let you do nothing it doesn't now. let you design i mean if you're designing you can design and move your nodes like for for instance on silhouette you can change nodes, you can change sides, you can do anything on Silhouette. But with Cricut, you can't move, you can't alter nodes, you can't shift your nodes around. So, yeah, no. Mm -mm. It's Absolutely not. Absolutely nada. That's so cute. I love the way it turned out. It came out really, really stinking adorable. Uh, did you pay for the pro version? No, she deleted it. I did. I, I, um, I pay for the business edition. It was marked down um, on swingdesigns.com. You can get it for $50 when they mark it down to 50. I'm not sure if it's $50 now, but I got the business edition, which allows me to make a lot of editing. Um, I thought you were talking about Cricut. I'm sorry. Oh, no. Cricut, no. I had the $10 a month version. I don't use it enough to pay for that. So once I stop paying it, it doesn't, it, well, even when I had the paid edition, it doesn't let you edit any, any files. I mean, that is limit. You're limited on what you do. On Very limited. But if you have just the regular silhouette, uh, like me, I won't be able to do stuff that you do. You can. Yes, you can. On the unpaid version, yes, you can. There's certain things you can't, but for the most part, you can, yes. Okay. And But it's worth getting that $50 one because right. you don't have to. You, if you pay the $50, it allows you, you to make nothing else, yeah, you don't nothing have to else ever again. Right. You don't have to do that monthly paying. Right. Uh, Mike says I have both. See, and I don't use my Cricut, Cricut Maker 3 enough. The only reason I'm holding on to it is because, one, it cuts fabric. And if I wanted to cut fabric, I can cut it on my Cricut. Um, but I real I prefer my Silhouette by far. By far. I mean, I've designed a lot of things on my Silhouette, which I need to start working on. So... Well, we've been on here for three hours and 14 minutes, and Vanessa hasn't come back. Are you guys ready to get off? Yeah, it's 520. Yeah. Well, guys, tomorrow, don't forget, I am over on my channel tomorrow at 8 Eastern, 7 Central, 6 Mountain, 5 Pacific Standard Time. Friday and Saturday, it's over on my channel. And then on um, Sunday is when we have our sale, Sunday, Monday. Um, so on Monday, we won't have our usual, you know, shenanigans, but
but Tuesday we will on my channel Tuesday through Thursday it will be at 2 Eastern 1 Central 12 Mountain 11 standard 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time Tuesday through Thursday will be the shenanigans on my channel and then we'll back to Vanessa's channel so yeah Mike we'll says I have a Cricut Ventura and a Silhouette 4 Pro um did venture which one's that one i don't think i've ever that's heard of that one. one is that the new that's one the yet? new one i think that's the new one. Oh, that is that the thousand dollar one and the pro i've heard a lot of people that don't like the pro because there's like a lot of issues that they've had with the pro i have a cameo four but not the pro but cameo silhouette just came out with the cameo five and the curio two I'm assuming Cricket's coming out with something new too. Watch, just watch. Well, although they did have that new one that came out, which was what a thousand dollars for that machine. That big machine. Yeah. So yeah. He's cutting some big stuff. Yeah. I like his name. What the fuck, Mike? There's a big lag. There is a huge lag. I just realized I've had candy bar. Yeah, my venture was like thirteen hundred dollars. Oh my god, what do you what do you use for all that? I mean, what do you use it for? Do you have a t-shirt business, some kind of a business, a car wrapping business? What do you use it for? Their, their machines are expensive, and you're limited. That software is so limited. But you can, what you can do is buy the business edition from Silhouette, design on Silhouette, save it as an SVG file, and then bring it over to Cricut. You can do that. That's what I do. Welcome back, Carrie. Welcome oh, back. Well, the silhouette was nine, yeah, the Silhouette Pro was 900 Yeah, I don't understand why Cricut is so expensive. Vinyl Final stickers for the tractors. Me. Ah. What is that this? That's a good business. Yeah, that is a good. That, that's why. Are you going to get the new um, Cameo 5 that's coming out? I'd like to see what the difference is with the Cameo 5. There's one thing about it. If you got the Ventura, you don't have to line up nothing. It'll cut it all in one, you know? The what? The Ventura. You don't have to worry about lining up anything. It cuts it all out at once. Really? It's, yeah, it's for, start for John Deere costs between five. What? Per side. Ooh, I'm on the wrong side of business. <laughs> I need to stop, need to stop you paper crafting. You need to make your machine work for you. I know. You can make what car stickers, heck? window stickers, and anything. Which vinyl, which vinyl do you use? See, when I had the store, I had a lot of people ask me to bring vinyl in. and then Oracle's the best. Yeah, Oracle uh, 651. Which one do you use? The Starcraft, I was going to start, before we decide to close the store, I was going to start carrying Starcraft. I know right. one thing, Cricut Vinyl ain't no count. No, Cricut Vinyl like is Oracle. not good. I like Oracle. Yeah, I Oracle is a good one. That's a good brand. I have some because uh, Tim's uh, daughter and her husband owned a sign business. And he would bring me uh, the vinyl. Yeah, they're expensive. It's expensive stuff. Mm -hmm. I have some good stuff. Well, y'all know tomorrow on my channel I'm doing more Halloween stuff, but it's for here because Nani needs... Hope your stuff comes in for your hat. No, actually, no. Oh, you ain't ordered it yet. 
for my hat. Oh, I thought that's what you ordered from Joanna. Joanna. No, I went I went to Joanne's and picked up fabric. This is what I picked up, but I think I'm gonna now that I thought about it. So I got some ticking, but then I went to yeah, Hobby Lobby and the ticking UV resin UV resistance. Uh, oh really? U line has um UV resistant? Wow, how much is it? So Hobby Lobby had the ticking 40% off. Which look at the difference. This ticking at Joanne was $14.99 a yard. I didn't bother to think about Hobby Lobby. So on my way home, I said, well, let me check Hobby Lobby. For fabric was 40% off. Ticking is uh $5.99, I believe. I didn't get any because Nani says, Mommy, I already got some ticking. Why are you getting any more? So I got this um this to make some of my witch's clothing. And I got this blue ticking. Ooh, that plaid's pretty cool. And yes, ma'am. It depends on the size of the row. Really? Wow. And I got this uh, muslin. Yes, it says I need... I'm back. I needed muslin. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome uh, back. Apparently, you can hear me. And I use this black chalk because i have to do my hat black i had to do the cut right, the hat yes, go ahead i had to cut the hat out of muslin and i have to use wire um floral wire to shape the hat and then polyfill and then i use a mixture of like the like cinnamon and stuff to make it rusty and then i use black black paint the muslin black hundred sheets was $125. How many, how wide is a sheet? I guess that's, uh, oh yeah, 12 by 12. I don't know. 12 by uh, 12? Vanessa. That's a little expensive. Yes, ma'am. Did Mike buy a bottle off of you that had roses on it with lights in it? Huh? Mike thinks that he bought a bottle off of you that had roses on it with lights in it. Off of mm, no, not me. Was it it might have been May, because Mason no. made them bottles. I made bottles, but I've only, uh, I've never sold any of my bottles. Oh, it's Reason a 35 by 10 and a half. Oh, that's not that's bad. That's not bad. Not bad. It's almost like a yard. Well, I don't know where he bought his bottle. It wasn't me because I don't, I, um, the one bottle that I had. Um, he was thinking it was going to my one bottle that I had, I used plaster on it to make it look weird and distorted. And um, I didn't sell that. I ended up, it stayed in the house when we sold the house, actually, because it stayed with the decor. Um, and then, or no, I kept, I took it to Wyoming and I think I donated it. Or someone, I think, I don't know, someone took it when I was giving the stuff away in Wyoming. Who knows? You have pictures of this bottle? Yeah, you have pictures of the bottle? He says if you buy it in the rolls, it's cheaper. At this point, why don't you, I mean, I'm sure you can get it wholesale. Can you buy it wholesale? That's not bad. Yeah, I can take a picture. It's right in front of me. 
That'd be good and send it to me on Facebook. Vanessa, you had us all confused. We didn't know we were streaming from two places. Uh, because the cricket will cut up to 75 feet. I didn't need to. Send it to who? Vanessa. Send it to me. Do you make something and you ever you see, like, I don't want to sell that. Where can he find you? What's the name of your <coughs> Facebook? I mean, peanut butter and bananas. Mm, <laughs> it's doing, KK, it's doing Vanessa like you. It's posting on both. I think it's the setup because connected and made the admin on my um uh but it didn't, yard, but it didn't so be... it'll connect to hers too. Yeah, but, it, but it's it the first time it's done this. Yeah, it's never done that before. No. Oh. It's crazy. Crazy, baby. We were confused. Well, this you can get some views too. Ha! <laughs> well, that's why nobody could see people chatting. You know. Mm hmm. I'm gonna have my. I didn't know we're Freaking streaming on two channels. Yeah, I didn't know we didn't either. Hey. Hey. hey we hi. didn't know that was possible. Ah, uh, my picture's a, a girl with glasses. With yellow around it. An anime. Isn't it your animated face? Is it the one that's on yeah. here? On the I YouTube? Anime. I was able to use my, uh, that's what I was it's saying, is my Joanne, that would be yeah. a gift card because they said that I would have to call in my order. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, heck no. So I drove my butt right over to Amazon, uh, Joanne's and I said, no, they ain't going to scam me anymore. I'm going to waste this money before they try to say I don't have the money anymore. And it worked. <laughs> yeah. At first it didn't want to work. No. And then I, I was like, oh, heck no. And we're not doing this again. So finally she got it to work. Well, oh, good. What else did you buy besides fabric? That was it. Just enough to uh, polyfill to make my witch. I think I'm just going to record that one though. It's too much, too much to do live, and I gotta. I already did well, one live next on it. Next week, next week, I'll get with you girls. But I have something that we all four can do together. Okay. I saw one thing my that I thought we could my talk. Facebook. Some roses thought, around the cross. There was something I thought we could do, which was a, a SVG, yes. uh, SVG cut has this haunted house, but I know you don't like, you don't have, like Halloween. She doesn't have to cut it as Halloween. She we gonna, we gonna, Halloween. we gonna get our hands dirty, baby. Did you see that, KK? There is a haunt SVG cut has this really cool looking haunted Halloween well, I house. Can't yeah, wait there's for a couple you to take I want. Email. I was like, oh my God, I want that SVG file. I want you to check that email. Look look at that freebie I sent you. Okay. I'll look at it. I put it I put it in the chat for them to get, but I actually got it to send to your email. That's I forgot that you have that weird looking email. So if I see just random numbers, I'm not gonna think it's, you know, think that it's a scammer. <laughs> Yes, oh, I had had my email had been Penny Kitzmiller at charter.net for years and years and years and years. Well, Charter uh, all of a sudden just canceled that email and didn't even let me know. I was wondering why I couldn't get my email. My whole my whole phone went blank. You remember I told you that? 
I was over really? there. And uh, they put up, they sent me up an email and put it as my phone number. Well, I you know, I didn't change it, but I've never done that. But I lost, I lost money because I was subscribed to these, uh, uh, you know, like uh, crafts, crafty, and all that, you know. And here they were taking money out, and I couldn't get in to cancel nothing because it was all under my email. Were you able to get it canceled? Yeah, I finally called them. Well, you know, um, no, that's, that's not for me. Y'all want to see? That was happening to me before when I couldn't get into yeah. my emails. There was a lot of things that I was, it's I mean, heck, heck, you know, what's one of the things that I paid that I didn't, I couldn't get in and cancel it. Um, uh, makers are going to learn. I don't suggest anybody ever pay for their yearly thing. So when I signed up for it, I was in Wyoming and I paid their hundred and some dollars. I think it was $150. And I never really used it. And then that was in the beginning, like January, Fe January, February, 2022. Then we moved to uh, Texas. I didn't have access to my email. That's and that's what they did. And they, <clears throat> that is pretty. Oh, no, that's not. Patricia. That's that oh, that would have been, me. I wonder, that would have been, um, was it Angela? Because I see satin and I see pearls. That would be Angela. Uh, anyway, my, um, huh? Patricia's got a question. Yes, Miss Patricia. Or we might, we might, Patricia, we may in a little bit, we may invite you or we may not. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh, so, did you read so, what she said, Patricia? May? Yes, are we going, are we going live? Um, um, wasn't planning on it. Did you need me to Possibly. cheer you up? Do you need she's to crying over her. Yeah, she's crying over her little oh. dog. And if we go even just on our little Facebook thing, we could invite her, can't we? Yeah. Uh -huh. Or we can just go live. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, give everybody a chance to grab something to eat and then we'll come back. Yeah, come back. we can come back. Yeah, we can do that, Miss Patricia. We need to cheer I was you like up. that last night, Patricia. I needed. I need. I was having like a panicky attack, and I and I just need to talk. I'm calling you back, Miss. I Penny. know. I went to. I, I laid down here and closed my eyes, and I did. I go. I went to sleep. And May Why did too. Did you May have my too. phone number. Why didn't you call me? Well, May did too. I I thought she was busy. I don't want to bother nobody. I was just. Oh my God! When have I ever been so busy? I was not going to be able to sit there and answer your phone call. If you called me. All right, Patricia. We will go get something to eat, and it is five o'clock right now. And we will try to be back what by seven, maybe. Yeah, seven, which is six your time. Gives you something to get something to eat. Anyway, listen, it's going back to my story. Now I forgot what was my story. Oh, uh, what was my Can story? Can one of you send me the link later? Thank you, ladies. Yes, we will. Yes, um, it's, it'll be Mace Channel, though. It'll be Mace Channel. Yeah, what was I you talking about? To start signing these you things. was trying to cancel subscription. Oh, right, okay. All right, so I had signed up before I left Wyoming. I signed up for Makers Gonna Learn, and I paid $150 for their yearly thing. A lot of the stuff from that was nothing but, you know, it was nothing. It was cutesy little things, right, not my right. taste, not my liking. So Pity I just bears. never logged in. <laughs> never log logged in or anything like that. Moved here, didn't have access to my email. Totally forgot about that. I did try. I did try to email them immediately after I signed up because it was not to my liking. I'm like, okay, cancel this because I will never use it, and I didn't use it because it was not about it. I bet. Well, I did email and told them I tried to go on their website. Um, as soon as I signed up, I was like, no, I don't like this. Canceled it, right? <clears throat> because I didn't want to continue the, the yearly thing. I had already paid for the year. And I'm like, well, I don't want to continue again and said it wasn't to my liking. So I thought I hit cancel so they wouldn't, you know, once the year was up, they wouldn't charge me. Well, I come down here. Couldn't get into my email, had no way to getting into my email. And guess what they did? They charged me another $150 for this year. I tried telling them they were so rude about it. Um, 
And they said, well, no, you um, already paid for it. Enjoy your year. And I'm like, I didn't even enjoy it the first time around because I didn't like your stuff. Yeah, they can check and see where you didn't sign in, too. Yeah, yeah. But I never checked in or nothing ever because I didn't like their stuff. Um, and I just didn't like, I just didn't like it. And I had not signed up in a year, but they charged okay, me okay. for it. But they charged me for it because Did I had no money back. Ever... No, no, they refused to get my money back. You mean you paid $300 and didn't get nothing out of it? I hate that. It, exactly. So because I couldn't get into my email. They just said, well, um, and I told him, I said, I attempted to cancel. I went into your website and I canceled it in 2022. As soon as I realized this is not for me, don't Hold charge. On just one second. For it. Hold on just one second. Tell Mike bye. Bye, Mike. Bye, Mike. Thank bye, you. Mike. It was nice seeing you again. Don't forget bye. to come back. back in the all right. All right. Go ahead. So, yeah. Um, so they charged me. So I couldn't get into my. I couldn't. They said, "We'll go into your email that you used to sign up." Well, damn it, I couldn't get in. I could not get go. In. Yeah, they. I couldn't neither. There's no way. And I went to the Dagon company down here, and they sat for hours and hours and hours trying to get it, so that I could retrieve some information. Mm -hmm. There was some important stuff that I needed out of that email, and they're yep. saying that they're saying it charter uh, done away with it, just done away with it. And I've yep. never heard of that. They've always well, kept, you know. I got charged another hundred and fifty dollars, and I was mad. I was livid. I was oh, like, really? "And you guys can't cancel." So after like telling them, finally they went in. Okay, we'll cancel it for you. But enjoy your year. You've already paid for it. Kid you not. Oh, they charged me for it, and I'm. I, I thought they, if you canceled it, you got a refund nope, of what was nope, left. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. That's why I refuse. Well, Make it gonna shitty. learn. That's scammers. Pay for another freaking ass year that of the. I didn't even use it the first time. Why the hell uh, am I gonna pay for it the second uh, time? Three hundred dollars out the drain. Mm -hmm. Yep. Well, I'd use it. I, I, yep. I. They think you can't, but yep. I would. I'd use it. I can't even, I don't know, I don't know the login. And oh, so, well, call them and get a login then. Make them give you a new login. And if you don't use it, send it to somebody else. And I but guess I'm I can go in and now that I ha I can get into that email, um, because it's the same, this same email that I use for YouTube, I, I guess I can go in and reset it. But I didn't even think, I'm like, you know what? I don't even like, I didn't even like it. Well, I get, little, I get at stuff. least something out of it. Or cutie somebody, stuff that I'm not into. Somebody and, else. Yeah. Maybe have give it give if I can access it, give it to someone else to log in. But there's only four more months left into it. Well, four months Point. is better than nothing. They got a whole freaking year on me. I said, oh, I gave them a piece of my mind. I said, y'all are scammers. God, oh, that makes me mad. Eats me up. $150 this year and $150 last year. Got to be careful sometimes. I always, you know what I've learned? Before I click anything or buy anything, I go to the very bottom of the screen and it'll say terms. Mm -hmm. And I find it and I read the terms because it'll say that you're going to pay $9.95 shipping and handling. But if you mm -hmm. keep on reading in them terms, you're going to be charged $135 within two weeks. Yep. Well, I had another situation. Um, so I don't do that crap no more. Paste it. Well, you know, them scams about just paying shipping. You get mm -hmm. this, but you just pay ship as a scam. Yep. Well, the other day on Facebook, they had this one thing. Right. Um, to, you know, it was... Sign up to learn how to do better videos with better uh, lighting and better this and better right, that. I right, signed up. Right. Yeah, and it I seems see like, it. well, I went in, it's one thing. You clicked on the thing. Oh, it's, uh, I think it was $19. Oh, but if you do this and you get that, it's $22. And if you get this and you get that, it's uh, $27. And if you do this boot camp and you do that, it's $67. And every time I'm on, and I, so I clicked out. I'm like, this is nothing but money grab, you know? 
Right. They went and charged me $46. Oh, I emailed them. Oh, I sure enough did. I said, oh, hell no, you did not charge me. I said, you're doing nothing, but you click on your site and then you get this and you get that and you buy it. I did. I had to go through my bank. That's why I had to get a new bank card because they went in mm -hmm. my bank account and got money out of my bank when yep. it said zero. said zero will be deducted. And I had the email where it said zero will be deducted from your card. And I showed it to my bank and they give me my money back and blocked them. Yep. I had that happen to me the other day, just the other day. Right. And I it's, emailed oh, her. Oh, I hate it. I, but they did, they, it's pending right now on whether or not they give me my money back, but they well, my did bank the money out of my bank. My money. Money. And next thing you know, I get an email saying, thank you for signing up for this and paying for that. I'm like, oh, $46. I I said, oh, that. heck no. <laughs> my bank, my bank gave me my money back immediately, you know, pin and if it would have been did an investigation and then if it would have been, you know, faulty, I would have had to pay it back. But I got a letter saying that they, they found that they were negligent. I wish I had done that with mass. Uh, well, I, you know what? I mean, did I try with the bank? I thought you that probably, was very strange. You could have probably done that. Yeah, you didn't tell. With our bank. I should have. I didn't even think about that. You know that? And by the time I was so busy working, I honestly, uh, Eric's uh, the one that brought it to my attention. Did you sign up for this? And I'm like, at the time, I was really, really working. I'm like, no. I have you had time, have time to, to call. Look how, look how long it took you to call Joanne's. Yeah. Well, and now, <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> true. I called Joanne yesterday. Very true. But at the time, I was I wasn't even crafting, and that was the sad part. I wasn't even crafting. Oh mercy! Oh man, that's horrible. I bet that made your heart drop. It did, and I was just working to help pay the bills, and I was like, "Oh heck no!" I told I him, "I said you're a when scammer." They just, when they just take money off of somebody for nothing, you don't get nothing. All right, guys, we're gonna go have dinner. And then we'll come back at 7 o'clock. So it's going to be 8 Eastern, 7 Central, 6 Mountain Standard Time, uh, 5 Pacific Standard Time over on my channel. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to make. I'm not sure what KK is. KK is probably going to work on her journal. Um, right. and, um, and you may, because you may like what I sent you and may print it out. Okay. I, here's my little journal. Isn't it cute? Oh, you know what? I could probably work on the boho bee for this. That's right. probably what I do. Finish that up. Right. Isn't that pretty? Came out cute, guys. Look at that. I didn't know what I was gonna do. I was a little That's bit dumbfounded cute. because I'm not one to make lots of pages. I'll show when the light's not so. Y'all know I don't make lots of pages. Like lots of pages makes my mind go. My ADD. They goes. all like it. Carrie says it's adorable. Thank you. And Patricia said it earlier. All right, let's see you guys at 7 Central. Right. Bye, everyone. Ooh, I have people watching. Thank Bye, you guys. Thank you all for, thank you all for being for here.